came in there with that, he losing energy. You blame nah, somebody I else. Like, <laughs> no, I ain't gonna hold you. I feel like overall, his man got the better songs. I thought he had the okay, better okay. beat, the better production. I just thought overall, his song was better quality. Nah, his so, man did have more of the facts when you break down the bars of what went on. And easy, he get quiet when facts e get thrown Because easy, because respectfully, I can't let it go. Easy did call niggas liars and hating ass bitch ass niggas for six years for something that happened. So we do got to get at them for that. You did, you did, you did make the world think all the platforms is hating in line for it to be the truth. We got to address that one day. We we cannot let, let that go because it was a lot of bitch ass niggas and lying ass niggas in that era that it didn't happen and niggas was hating and don't go on niggas platforms and all type of shit that time. I ain't forgetting that and nigga cool, but I ain't forget what he did. <laughs> He got away with it, but he ain't get away, away with, with it. it. No, he did not. Shit, nah, bro. Niggas Shout was letting niggas you, just totally just take niggas whole character away off of off telling the truth when he was lying. But everybody else was the lie. That nigga slick and bracing it cold and rapping about bro. it. He's slicking bracing that shit now. Hey, yo, bro, yo, I, about getting punched I, and all type of shit. Niggas just, I, niggas just left it be cool. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, yo. Hitman's uh letter to the game. I feel like that's that shit still fire. That I feel like that's to the better. game was way, that was way harder. I feel like it's better than everything. You know what I'm saying? But I'm just talking like what sound better in my ear when I'm playing it in the car. I ain't gonna lie. Easy shit sound hard. The way, the way he rapping on it. See, I gotta get production. in that contest. See, that's how you know what shit really is. Yeah. So you can listen to it and you gotta put it in that contest. Yeah, put it in the speakers, bro. I'm gonna put it in that contest. But like I said, Easy just get critiqued more uh, heavy because I heard this song from Easy. That's just crazy, folks. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. No, yeah, that that top tier did top tier champion. And I think and I think that's all he a victim to. I think the Yeah, he's a victim to what he have done. Yeah, he's yeah. To his own greatness, I can see that. Yeah, he got froze because listen, froze. When Easy said he was dropping after what I didn't heard, bro. I'm listen. I didn't listen to the other four tracks back. I'm excited. I said, Easy. Listen, when they got, I'm gonna keep it a hundred. The, the the B selection that Easy picked me when I heard Hitman shit. First thing I thought in my mind was the Hitman in trouble, cause I know how Easy get. I know how Bro get on them tracks. He gonna have that hard eight oh eight. He gonna be talking that shit. When I heard the lullaby, I said, "Oh, Easy came with the let's be cool. We already battled, but I'm gonna cook you type beat. That's what that beat was. We already battled, but I'm gonna cook you to let you know I cooked you. But I ain't really trying to over. Ha, ha. Hitman did the same thing. I ain't lose." Hey, they ain't gonna look good on cam, but I'm gonna let y'all know. <laughs> That's what they both did. Folk, they gave us something to talk about, but it wasn't. Nah, we gotta. But if we if we gotta pick a winner though, if we picking a winner. Hit hey, me that's up. what that's what Holla said. Pick a winner, not mm. not that both, not yeah, both of them. Cool. Or it was pick a winner. Right, that's what had this track go. You gotta pick a, a winner, draw. and on round one, hit man up. I think, one it's draw, draw. Nah, it I think they knocked each other out, G, with this one. It ain't, nah, nah, it ain't no draw. I hear y'all St. Louis. Listen, who you got, bro? Listen, I hear you St. Louis, Louisianians. I hear y'all. I hear y'all, cute. I hear you, the boss. I I'm get it, y'all. Listen, I get it. Y'all to do what I want. Wherever you at, hit man and easy. That's cool. What I won't allow y'all to do is sit here and act like it was a gap in between either one of these Jones, like because it wasn't. No, I never said that either. Yeah, but I think it's preference. I thought that Easy took more of a commercial flow on his. You know what I'm saying? And and again, it made it more like a track than Easy the, had that Remy on the beach roll out. Yeah, right, right. Yeah, I, I, don't think, I also think that uh, the flow that he took on that beach, you got some of his diss lines got missed. You know what I mean? So I just think that the transitions were quick. I prefer a little bit more of a pace beat where you can actually really get at the nigga you trying to talk about and, and nothing get missed. But all in all, I thought it was close, man. I don't really think nobody like ultra poured away. Like on Tuesday, I like holler shit. On Wednesday, I like easy shit. I agree. Shit. I, like that, I think it's even, yo. No. And I, I feel like, I don't know, for me, I'm judging it off of everything, like like the lyrics, the, the production, the beat, the, the aesthetic. If I'm judging it off the totality, the total package, I feel like Hitman got it. I know, but I mean, hearing that from you, boss, knowing that he beat Hitman in a battle, I just feel like you just looking for a W to give him type shit. But it wasn't though, because I had no problem saying that Hitman, that I had easy winning that battle. That's what I'm, I'm saying. Sure. It, it wasn't like a, oh, it was a, <laughs> it wasn't a struggle or nothing. <laughs> but no, I just think, um, I do think you're right though. I think we so used to easy diss tracks kind of like banging, mm -hmm. slapping our TV, as Cola would say. 
You know what I'm saying? And this one wasn't that. You know what I'm saying? Um, he on switched top of it fact, up. He I switched think, it up. Yeah, and I think some of us assumed because it was a delay in him putting his out. I think we assumed they probably went back and changed some stuff, make it hit a little harder, this, than the other. So when you have people waiting a little longer, even though it's only hours, yeah, right? Fuck that. I'm going out the time, Hitman man, one. Easy, you a liar. Right? Fuck it. I'm hey, going out the window. Hey, Easy, you a liar. Hitman one. Wait, Bottom line. What, 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 what you got? What you got, bro? You got something from TikTok? Yeah, yeah, I got some shit. Hey, bro. Easy, a liar. Hitman one. Fuck it. I'm too. I'm going all off the rip. Where your where your where your ass this at, bro? Nah, I ain't dissing ass. I'm gonna see him on the fourth single tomorrow weekend when I buy it. Easy loss. He a liar. Fuck it. But nah, I got some shit for TikTok. I'm dropping next week. Oh, okay. You got something for who? Uh, Make sure. Uh, so T Top. T Top said he's right waiting on one of you niggas to say his name. Yeah, he don't have to wait no longer. He got a fight right here. He ain't got to go nowhere for it. What the fuck you talking about? <laughs> hey, hey y'all, I got y'all, like, bro. He, easy he, loss, folks. He lied. <laughs> What are you laughing about, though? <laughs> he, he laughed about that two piece shit, leg and thigh. <laughs> <laughs> leg and thigh, leg. You know, on Tuesday, church has got the thigh and breast combo. <laughs> he lied, bro. He can't just be keeping you meeting this shit now. He said half the culture of blogs was Henny Man was lying, Black Compass was lying, Angry Fan and Drizzy knew was lying. Everybody was lying, bro. Now Drizzy, he's... <laughs> Drizzy still ain't returned. <laughs> Oh, we did that to him. Don't worry about that. We got, we took care of that. We got something up out of here. Don't worry about him. That nigga but, turned into a pastor. I couldn't believe that shit. Yeah, he, yeah, because he was there and lied, then lied and said he didn't see it after lying, telling angry fan. Let me see that happen. Niggas was lying like a motherfucker. Bro, y'all let these niggas lie like a motherfucker. And for y'all don't say nothing because y'all be wanting to be around these niggas. So y'all gonna go listen to these liars. She on these niggas liars. Nigga call all y'all nigga dick ears and said y'all was lying about something that really happened. <laughs> all right, so speak. Okay. And y'all so sitting that on. bitch every day knowing he lies to y'all. Hold on. Hold on, cuz. <laughs> speak, speak on that situation real quick, right? If he would have just came out and said, okay, this is what happened, blah, 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 and, let, and got it over with. I don't even think that shit would have been it ain't even, like Listen, that. it ain't even about you coming out right, right, blah, 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 saying lying. But for you to boldface come and say, don't fuck with anybody that's hating and lying on me and these companies and don't do this and that. When you when you a full-blown liar, it's out of pocket, Q. It's no making that up, bro. You old niggas a public an apology. Because you lied whether you was trying to cover it up. That's not the... That's like... Listen, bro. Again, that's like forcing ABC... NBC, Fox News, not to cover a worldwide murder, bro. This is like, bro, you 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 asking ESPN not to cover that LeBron James, if so, got caught cheating. This is what you trying to get to ESPN. You trying to get ESPN, Fox News, the biggest the biggest platforms in the world to say, we know you, we caught you cheating on Savannah, but we just didn't see it. Well, now you get to it, come back it, out six months later out. after you divorced. And then Savannah get to say, you get to say, yeah, I cheated on Savannah. And nothing happened. But you said all these people was lying. Hold Same up. thing. Bro, you know, hold up, Spills. Same thing he just, R. Kelly did. What R. Kelly do when he sat down with Gail King? The nigga was crying and everything like he didn't do right. shit. They lying on me. They lying, they lying on me. Ain't it that worked. what he said? It worked for the, uh, Brandy, though. And that nigga, everybody else, bro. Man, sorry. Everybody else, they get caught smoking weed. Stephen A. Smith. Bro, I ain't talking about smoking. Bronny smoking no weed. Bro, I'm giving you it, an listen, example. Listen, but you got to understand, that's a bad that's a it. bad example in this world, New Orleans. And I'm going to tell you, you why. Because the whole world is smoking now. Getting cold back smoking back then ain't like like, like it is now, Spills. It's because it's, no cause it's legal. Like, Bro, man, listen. Like, that's shit, that, that LeBron was drinking... You saw what the Corey Richardson did? She embraced it. And Bro, that's because at... right now you can do that. If she would have got caught when Lance Armstrong got caught when he was doing PD error, she would have been right. fried, barbecue, right. and, 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 and pan fried. Every, the, the, basically, the, the weed is legal down there in 30 states almost. And you could basically say 50 because niggas been smoking whether they wanted them to or not. Publicly on the blocks, outside on blocks, right in the car, outside the car. Now, if you get caught, that's the discretion. But niggas been smoking. That shit ain't like it was back then when you, man, nigga got caught smoking weed in the NBA. Shit, every NBA player telling you after he retired, he smokes. 
Then you see them doing tests in why they should bring this in. And smoke, it helps the athlete body recover and all this shit. So it ain't going to be as big as then now. But you getting you real quick. And then you telling them motherfucker else they hating on you because they got to report a story. Or don't fuck with them or this, this, and that. For you to come out and live on the story. Come on, my niggas. Now, come on, y'all. Now, I understand y'all like these battle rappers. But something right, right. Because, again, a lot of niggas could have lost careers with the... With the uh, with the shit that you was doing, if they weren't strong enough, with your denials of it happening and the niggas hating on you. What about other niggas' livelihoods and other niggas' well-beings with just reporting what they have heard? Because nobody knew it was true. It's all a rumor. But when you when you go into the, the, the extra extent, a nigga got to... A nigga gotta look at that like, bro, you lied though, G. So let, let me just let me be clear. He Cole, lost. You, he down one over. Are you saying you didn't have a problem with him saying something didn't go down? You had a problem with him attacking people who said they heard exactly. I, I had a problem with him attacking and, 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 and using that as don't fuck with them. They hating on me, these bitch ass niggas. I didn't gave them so much. When a story is a story. Now your job, even with that story, is to say, hey, bro, I know you reported this. If that's what you want, hey. I, 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 if, if I, I fuck with you, bro, could you just do it? If you, could you just do me this solid? Nah, a nigga can understand, but you can't, something can't happen to you and you full bloody deny it. And also in denying it, you deem other platforms and other people as hating, bitch ass niggas, liars, and, and, and just been hating on you and all this shit when the actual facts of what happened and what they're reporting actually happened. So now you saying fuck every nigga that was a reporter job. I can see if I was. Muslim poppy and I just came out the side and I'm breaking the story down but as a blogger you did that to every blogger for the for the to, you try to deface every blogger in their truth within your lie that's crazy froze I ain't gonna lie I'm a real man now nigga finna be 39 I'm a real man and I don't play on the internet like you so try to really shit on niggas so so all for that all for your analysis of that he lost hitman one oh hitman one oh Hitman one oh, cause think about it, we were still speculating around when he when Hitman Hitman and them battled. You know what I'm saying? When Hitman and, and Easy battled, this wasn't really a big thing. Easy still was in the solid. Then you got to understand other shit. But did it even happen? No, then? it happened. It ain't happened. Then. That's what I'm trying to tell you. So he, this is what I'm saying. He was in the solid. That's what I said. When Hitman when he battled Hitman, then he was in the solid. Nothing had that happened. But when it did happen. I'm just telling you what went. Now, if he just went back in the back cut and everybody that knew would have held it down. But when you publicly doing interviews talking about nothing happened and niggas is this, he sat on Fro's couch and said nothing happened. The interview's still there. He sat there and said, oh, Wallahi. That's what he said. Niggas start, niggas, 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 Froze, it's your hey, fault. They, he lied. Hey, they lying. They Froze, blame Froze lying. for him. Hey, they Froze lying. got. They lying, listen to me, y'all. Froze got more. Froze got more slack for saying he let him lie than him actually lying. I'm just saying, folks. And this ain't nothing. This ain't now. saying easy and Froze. We just seen the super stream. Go check the easy and Froze super stream. It's a goodie. I see easy sitting there before it started. Listen, all that. But the truth is the truth. The man sat on the couch. My boy Frozenberg got more pushback for something happening to another nigga, him just being a host of something, than the actual person himself. And y'all let it rock. They did try to, they tried to fry. They didn't bro. try. Why didn't say that? Why didn't say that? The reason being, because that bit was like, what, 15 minutes? <laughs> like 20. If you love I fake, you're going to hate real. real. That's what Calico said. Lost my cousin to some fake pills. Hey, they they lying how up too, man. I, I think that's a, that was conspiracy, man. Especially to come to find out they were fucking around after that, man. They gave my boy them fake ass mics and shit that didn't work. Yeah, they lied to <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. This nigga, see this one? No, no, no. Q might be on or something, man. Q might be on or something. Yeah, I'm no, I'm just funny. I'm just funny. Hey, Q, that was a good assessment, though, G. Mike's <laughs> fucked up. Don't oh. let Hitman hear that. <laughs> He's been putting that pressure on her. You better have the mics right in their thing. We for the beat this nigga. This for the company. They went in that bitch with a plan. Okay. Uh, Talk that oh, bullshit. Think, you think they backdoor holler? They backdoor <laughs> holler, G. Yeah, sick, man. Easy was already putting pole to her. He already had command. It's up. He already, he already listen, you see how they go. Listen, I knew at the face offs how he how he was talking to uh how he was talking to Jay Black and them at the Chrome Face Offs in New York. And yeah, how, how he was talking to Geese. He like, yeah, we gon'. I'm damn. That's that sound like a nigga piping. 
when niggas start saying we and this and Oz and yeah, so nigga. At what point? At what point is, is, is do we get to a point where that angle is like we ain't, like we ain't never. that angle against that either? angle never die. Never because he lied. Anybody he battle, he get to just he lied. Any music. nigga that said that, bro, nah, you gotta understand. I think bro. It, it, nah, it ain't now. over, nigga. Hitman just put out a diss song using the same angle. Nah, I'm saying, I'm saying, like as far as battle rap wise. No, nah, it ain't over. It's over. never that over. Shit ain't over. See, man. see, it's over. It's over when it ain't the nigga that you ain't the nigga that nigga lying on to try to make seem like a sucker nigga when he's doing the line. See, nigga always want it over when it ain't on their account. But again, what about all the niggas you fuck with that he lied on in the journey of trying to defame the shit when we just was reporting what we heard like everybody else? When he said it was facts and none of the other niggas like Henny Man, think about all the niggas that got attacked in that Henny Man, Angry Fan whole panel. They told the truth then lied after uh, us. <laughs> uh, bro, it's about five, six platforms that was supposed to be bitch ass niggas and hating and envious and all that. That shit don't just get to go and rock like that. In what world? Because it wasn't you? Nah. Mm -mm. We yeah. never let that slide, nigga. That shit forever. That's forever, nigga. You you forever. That's that's one sucker move forever on your resume. If you know a nigga, you say one whole ass shit he did. That's forever the whole shit on his resume, for sure. You tried to front and stunt and was ready to crash out on niggas for something that really happened to you. Y'all ain't say nothing about y'all. Y'all, but everybody else, y'all, y'all, y'all ridicule. Bill Collector, all the niggas that had altercations that something that happened, y'all ridiculed that the truth was in front of y'all eyes. But y'all let a nigga lie and untruth his truth uh, through other platforms like we the bitch ass niggas. Like we just start getting pussy. Like we just start getting money. Like we well, just start reading. Well, well, Bill, Bill said they rolled on him. Holler said it ain't go like that. Well, shit, from 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 from, from the estimation you was wood when you first looked up, it looked it like a roll though. No, shit, the results right. looked it like and a roll shit, though. And that so shit you gotta understand what's going ago. on. Yeah, and it's still, and hey. that still hit, and it still hey. hits to this day. Hey, Cola, Polo, what up, man? What's the word? Yo, what up, yo? Whoever said uh, whoever hey, said they fuck with Hitman Holler Mike, that shit was hilarious. Whoever said that, that was funny. Can I? They said what was five months on Black Compass though? Huh? Can I drop this diss song on Black Compass though? Where's that? Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm about to leave the. I'm finna leave the studio right now. I'm finna send it to you, bro. Okay. Who, who you dissing? You, bro. All that shit got something to do with the diss record, bro. Because a diss record, a diss record got you in believing. So we breaking down a diss record of what's hit, said. The facts gotta matter, Dutch. The facts gotta matter because Hitman is still addressing in those facts what we're talking about right here. Y'all act like we talking about some shit that they they rapping and dissing each other about two totally different and they things. No, up he's too, dissing, like, he's dissing a nigga about Remy and this, this, and that. So nigga, it is actually accurate to the point. And that's what be with you niggas. You niggas that know us more than you ever had had words with them and be, no, nah, you niggas lying and it don't make sense. Man, shut your goof ass up, man. And, and, and just be on the nigga side you know that may send you five dollars, nigga. Like hey, all this, man. He lying hey, just, bro, just to get a be, tweet. Stop this bro, shit, bro. You be rapping on beats, bro. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Get ready, nigga. I, I, I definitely dissed you. You were, like you made a diss song about. Tell him the nigga you dissed him is you, crazy. Oh, no, just on, let on. the nigga hear this let, shit. Hold on. No, nah, he know it. I let him know it. You you made a froze diss song or you dissed me in a diss like with like mad other people. No, nah, you the main focus. I don't like you. <laughs> so we ain't really, hey, I ain't gonna hold you. So we ain't even really had that many interactions for this long to be flying around. It's all right, I don't like what you said yesterday. <laughs> all right, drop that. Nigga shit. gotta drop that thunder. Yo, y'all talked about that. Oh, y'all talked about the easy disc. We talking about both of them right okay, now. Okay. That's the only, that's the only okay, topic. Okay. Just, nah, you was cooking. Bro. That's why I was like, you cook. You cook yeah, you know, bro. Because I, bro, listen. I'm a real nigga shit, folks. I would never live down that a nigga tried to tell my company down and then just show back up like ain't nothing happened. Y'all got me fucked up. If y'all thought it was going to happen, ain't, ain't no way a nigga threw a whole motherfucking, uh, what's the little things they throw in the store with the fire on it? The little shit they got on the little, little fire on the bottle. Ain't no way a nigga threw the fire through the bottle through... Yeah, yeah, Molotov. 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 yeah, nigga ain't through no Molotov through my window and then it's just nah, nigga back rapping and battling. We ain't gonna speak the real. No, it's always gonna be real with me. Whether you wanna hear it or not, nigga, and that's real. A nigga lied about something happened that happened. That's real nigga shit, bro. Nigga lost a uh, fight on the school ground for you just lost, folks. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Nigga said about I, I niggas. Thought, uh, I, thought, I thought easy this was kind of friendly. Um, like I don't know. I mean, maybe he did already beat the nigga in the battle. Yeah, he did. That's what I'm saying. Like he kind of got to give him that credit. He, he already beat the nigga in the battle. In the battle. Like, like uh, this is weird. It, it, I'm not be... even really supposed to be here. 
in actuality. I mean, I, I got to go back really on the do. battle, though, because now, now Sunset, what Sunset makes sense. Like, I got to really go back and see if the audio is tampered with and shit, man. I got to really... But no, but we can't we can't say he already beat him in a battle we ain't supposed to be here when Easy is the one who who did the challenge to hit me. That's man. true too. That's yeah, because you yeah, steady yeah. talking to me about this shit because you want to be challenged because you know I won. Like we're not gonna act like a little a little bait one in there. Like y'all come on. No, he Lewis. tried to say I thought it, I thought it started Ooh. because he tried to say he was the reason that shit got that many views. He was talking about the views, but right. we know as a nigga that lost from the Midwest, I'm a Midwest nigga. He, that shit on his mind, bro. Hitman hate losing. I need to get something back. I'm telling you being a Midwest nigga. Fuck with the boss. I'm, I'm a Midwest nigga. We got to get ours back. <laughs> the fuck you talking about? Revenge is a thing. Well, oh, he got it back, man. Too. I'm a Midwest. Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm trying to tell her. She know exactly what I'm saying. We got to mm -hmm. get ours back. We got it back. Nah, y'all definitely. Hitman definitely up 1-0. Uh, it might be zero. They might have knocked each other out, Loki. But it, it won 1-0, -oh, maybe 1-0. One oh, hitman leaning the hitman. Hey, Polo, uh, Chef Trez got one out too. I had to tell Cola that. Yeah, I ain't even get a chance to check it out. I, I ain't even know that. That's crazy. How was it? How was it sounded? To me, it was chilling. I oh nah, it. don't just no this song chilling, man. I need like to hear he, some shit. Like he was like, like he, you know, he was shooting that. You know Wait, they chilling like you mean like it was you know, like on, laid back oh, he was on the killing. beat. Like he was laid back on the beat to me, like like it was like. Oh, that's Chef Trez. He he laid back. Uh, you like, know this this is a new era, so everybody giving out warnings now. Nah, nah, ain't yeah, no like, takeovers. Ain't no more. Niggas ethos. drop a dish warning, like yo, don't make me drop the next one. <laughs> like, what, what, yo, what, what, what niggas are you talking about, bro? <laughs> Yo, yo, don't make me drop the next one, nigga. The next one? The next one? <laughs> Not this one. I did this one for the T. Like, no, bro. Yo, get the fuck out of get here. Get the man. fuck out of here, bro. Drake put the, the game up. up. He did Who? that with charged up. Let me put this you see, up. Nah, you see my son Drake on that push, that push up. He was naming names. Naming That's niggas. That's what I'm saying, but he, he, he did that before the uh, That's a diss song. He dropped charged up and then he dropped back to back. Yeah, but he learned. I think he learned from that. I think he learned like, nah, I gotta hit him out there. But I mean, he dropped charge a back to back a two well, days. Well, if later. you listen to what he was saying to that nigga on charged up, he was really slow walking him though. There was it sounded like because from the B selection, yeah, like you talking about like that all. Actually, you actually go to about. what Drake was saying. To it was no, the dumpy one that was like the dumpy one that was like that nigga, bro. That dumpy one was type light. I think no, nah, dumpy was the the diabolical blow. Which one? One of them shit. I don't think none of them shits was like actually. Now nah, think about it. Charge back to the, it. Charge up was the shit. Math Hoffa remix, right? Y'all ain't hear the Math Hoffa. Math Hoffa that. did that too. Okay, yeah, nah, he went crazy on Charged Up. Yeah, nah, he went crazy on Charged Up. I'm about man, to I'm putting a poll. I'm putting a poll out right now. Pause. Who oh, winning right now, man? Hitman or Easy? I think Easy down for lying. Fuck it, I'm going all out. Yeah, so, I got Hitman up. I got, I got Hitman. Man. Hitman definitely got that first he, round. Easy won a battle, but he gotta get he gotta get he gotta get that deficit for lying. The nigga lied. It, but aside from the, the lying part, he he didn't really kind of say much on this on his this record. Like he didn't really yeah. say much. He got a battle, huh? Yeah, Hitman won a Hitman won a this record. He just said a bunch of don't make me talk about whoop whoop whoop. Like he ain't really say. I think the most the crazy shit he said was the niggas robbed your crib and they still alive like that type. That when he got in that bag, that was cool. He should have stayed in that pocket. Yeah, that was probably the best thing he said on that. Yeah, yeah, they still alive. How the fuck we gonna know them if they I came in the masked best, up I, and shot my bitch? Like, I, thought, I don't like. You feel me, froze? Like, I, thought the best thing. <laughs> I wasn't there. How? <laughs> I thought the best thing. <laughs> thing. I thought the best thing he said was the stairs and battle academy to keep it a B. I ain't even like that. Yeah, I thought when he started going in on the Philly people, I thought that's when he started cooking. Yeah, Cassidy, though. We went off of Cassidy, too. Yeah, I thought he was getting that Cassidy downstairs a little bit. He better chill out, man. Cassidy and Remy go way back. Cassidy come out and knock his head off, man. He hurt his feelings. Next one. Hey, is My that boy. something y'all want to see? That's something y'all want to see? Easy and cash. Yeah, I see a cat. Yeah, I, yeah, I'm with that. Yeah, I'm with that. Yeah, that's, that's I want to see the face off. You can make me nah, make a Cassidy, battle. Uh, Cassidy's a hundred percent going to respond to this. Like I'm pretty sure. Hundred percent. He's already this easy three times. So he, he, <laughs> what's the fourth what, time? What, 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 what I'm about to say. After he done flew the nigga out to the studio with the songs with him, so Cass don't need too much motivation. Like whatever yeah. reason, um, 
but I would want to see they battle for sure too. Like fuck hell guys, yeah, because I ain't gonna hold you, Polo. That'd be one of the most hilarious. Nah, for real, ever, that'd bro. be a goodie. You talking about two niggas who don't who think it's their world and we just live in it? That'd be a goodie. Like the face off will go crazier saying, than the, the battle. The energy, the energy nah, versus the energy. in that small Yo, trenches room, that nigga be godly. I'm gonna keep it a bean. Yeah, yeah cash in that room. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. yeah. No, but I'm just saying the face off ain't gotta be in more structure. Y'all just like, wilding yeah, each other. Nah, you just said the face off would be better, but I don't yeah, think that's a battle easy. Could just walk through and they like Cassidy in that small room setting is different. You see what he did to disaster. I'm five thousand in gold. My record dumb, nigga. I kind of got easy cooking, cooking Cassidy. Oh, no, I don't know. I think he's going to run into the same problem he had with Reed. The same problem with Reed. Yeah, he's going to have the same problem. Yo, niggas, niggas be a lot louder. I had him turn around. Nah. Y'all get me? Yeah, we hear you, my fool, bro. Oh, my bad, my bad. Yeah. Yo, but niggas be a lot louder about Cass's like bad rounds than his good rounds. Like, For real. If you, if you actually break down, you know, some of his good rounds throughout his battles, we've yet to see him besides maybe the disaster battle and they put an asterisk next to it because remember on stage it got fucked up, then they went in the parking garage and he dogged him. And it's like small room situation. Of course, Cass was going to do that over the stage where it looked like he wasn't going to have a good performance when he battled disaster his first run back. But if you go to his first round versus Holla, fire, right? And then like certain parts throughout his first round versus um versus Goods was all right. He just has yet to put it all together. But we've seen Cass have like success against top level battlers. And I think against a Philly dude, where a lot of his references is going to be more understandable. Mm -hmm. He's going to be able to get a little... Exactly. Right. I yep. think that's a, that's a dog. It's going to be the same. Yeah, and now you question. in his lane. Like, you in his territory now. Oh, so oh. I'm, about you, to, I'm asking y'all a question. Wasn't that uh, one of his battles in Philly and that nigga got booed in Philly? Against I mean, Arsenal? Versus, uh, versus Arsenal. But right, that battle was mad cringy. Mm -hmm. Arsenal pushing mad. him around. Bro, niggas bro, smoking bro. each other's face. Like, that oh, battle was cringy. Bro, the nigga flicked a boogie on him, bro. Like, what are you talking about, stuff? Like, that battle was weird as <laughs> shit. Bad. Yeah, yeah, I think the crowd was just mad at the battle. That battle, no, no, that battle was weird. Say, that's uh, my, my little brother. I'll get him up here. My little brother was at, he went to that battle for Cassidy versus Arsenal. And I asked him, I said, yo, why, why niggas front on Cass like that? He said, bro, niggas didn't boo Cass because they thought he was stinking it. They didn't like the way Arse was just disrespecting him. And they, they didn't uh -huh. like the response. Like, that wasn't a Philly dude response, right? Like, so that's where that really came from. Like, <laughs> fuck out of here, Cass. And that's the city of Philly in a nutshell. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, they ain't going to fight for a nigga who won't fight for himself. And and I guess... <laughs> You know, you had you had uh, Gilly up on there laughing at the shit Arsenal was doing. It was a bad look for Cass. I can't front. Yeah, that, that was a bad yeah. one. That, that was, was a cringy battle. Cass. But did he not? But did he not? Did he not whip disaster ass? Did he not get with Holler? Are you listen? Even if I even if you had Holler two one in that battle, I thought he clearly won the first round. The fact he got a round off Hollow crazy. I thought he clearly won the first round. And that was fake Hollow Prime a little he bit was too. Your grind balling, so I signed your Spalding. I ain't had time for talk. Like when he get into that bag, bro. Man. The nigga was fifteen. You was Cassidy when I was twelve. Of what course, you sound up like, bro. Everybody knew Cassidy the punch line. You Thank acting you, like bro. I was grown and walked up to you. I was a fucking teenage nah, ball you player. Taking the, you taking the context? No, nah, I ain't taking no context. I'm not over exceeding the context of what y'all yeah. trying to portray in that for little sure. small. I signed just Spalding. Nigga, I was 13. But All that right. make it even more significant that you signed my Spalding and I got you right now here. And I'm down to probably just as big as a draw in this battle is you at this moment in time. I told you I was going to battle you. Yeah, like. he was trying to let niggas know was. Like, all right, let's, let's just don't act like I wasn't this nigga favorite rapper at one time. That's all he was saying, Cola. That's all he was saying when I signed your Spalding. So relax. You still talking to Cassidy, remember? Like the nigga your pop brought to meet when you was a young boy? Like, it ain't no, it ain't no, it, I thought it was beautifully crafted. I don't give a fuck how old Holler was. Yeah, I, I, ain't, I, I ain't gonna lie. I, I will see. I would see Cassidy versus Easy. I'll see that one. Capolo <laughs> agree with me. That's why I ain't. Bro, I don't want to see Cassidy do nothing. Nah, Cassidy versus Easy on the trenches, and that trenches set up on the like that. First of all, first I'm trying not to first say it, Cola. Easy need to fucking win in a battle. <laughs> that's one. Two, that's what y'all that's what y'all overlook Cola as well. Cola I'm is on double fire. Double Listen, the man need fight. a fucking y'all acting like the boy been winning battles. <laughs> Let's get to that. Like he ain't been winning no fucking battles. 
So he's on two. He need this clips back. If clips go in there and beat him at sneaky, he oh did. nah, easy clips might, might be in trouble. I'm, it's so easy. He did might you be in John trouble. John yeah, yeah, I had John John Hell, beating him you, at you his career, Gigi, right? And I had Gigi Hell, knocked now, hold him on, hold on. This Gigi knocked cool. him and Remy out. No, no, I'm just, <laughs> but hold on, I'm just, I'm just asking Cole in here because Cole, you had him losing a read. I had Reed beat. This is what I'm saying. So, I so, uh, but, but see, because see, so I got him 0 2 in his last two. I agree with that. But you got him losing that Reed battle. I had Reed, Reed so, bro. Battle listen call, to bro, you got bro, him bro. 1 and 3 listen in his to me. last four. Th listen to me. And I'm going to tell you why this Reed battle. Listen, that Reed battle is why everything is happening now. The shit with Battle <laughs> Academy, all the shit that's happening now, Reed set that up. From right there when, if you boy, we know you. Bro, I don't give a fuck who you get on here. True foe, Big T, the, anybody, a nigga can't define, a nigga can't undefine my Chicago. Go find them. A nigga, I got addresses. I got apartment numbers. I got the third floor, second floors. You can't unhood my hood. Once he did that, that fucked easy up, bro, and everybody knew it. Because mm -hmm. this shit is about the real shit. Streets, music, art, bro. You can't be popping this shit in your hand. That's Takashi 6 9 Y'all ain't let Takashi get away with it. How the fuck he get to get away with it? He still don't have no addresses. And then the whole Philly to the world is telling us after they rebuttaled and said he wasn't from there and then gave him a flag, they taking the flag back. Hey, hey, am I that Cola got, got addresses on every side of the city? North, Hunnets, west, south, north, Hunnets. east. <laughs> what, what you talking about? A nigga can't undefine. Like, bro, it's no fucking way a nigga from the center of the battle say, Cola, you was, boy, we didn't know you if you was. Who? How, nigga? I'm from one of the biggest cities in America at that. Cody, you Ain't saying no on the north? Way. You saying it don't matter if it's on the north, south, east, or west side. Somebody know Cola. Somebody know Cola, nigga. I got a verified yeah, little city pass, nigga. Well, I got a bus card around this bitch. My shit work on air bus and train. You don't, you don't yeah, think? You don't think? You don't think that shit? You don't think that's corny for for niggas to stamp him, then get mad at him and say no, he not? I do think it's. I do think it's, that's, I do that's think corny it, for sure. I do think it's corny, but I also think it's corny when you just can't come out and tell us your grammar school, what auntie Sussa candy store was. Well, because we don't need nobody with you. Cause we know what was there. Like if I talk about up north, I can true folk gonna know the convenience was right there. Convenience store, you had the little Spanish store over there on Leland with the game room. He gonna know where the park at. He gonna know what Sunny Side at. He gonna know what all the shit gonna know, bro. What is you saying? What is you saying to rebut this? He gonna know on Broadway when they used to have Woolworth and Gold Blast up there. Then it changed. He gonna know City Sports come from across the street and went down. He gonna know Tony Sports went down there on Sheridan. Everything I'm saying. He gonna know what Gold's Gym used to be up there. It's gone now. That bitch Planet Fitness. He gonna know Stewart is lost now. Stuart Elementary ain't a school no more. Where we went, he gonna know it's lost. So if if Trufo was there or not, everything I'm saying, he can factual by knowing I was there because everything I'm saying, I'm not lying. He gonna know that all these up there. He gonna know everything I'm saying. He gonna know GGO's pizza. He gonna know everything I'm fucking saying, bro. Yeah, man, them uptown landmarks, man. You not north, gonna man. be at it. You not gonna be able to say, oh, for, for, and then niggas still guessing. Your only voucher is my daddy. That can't happen as a nigga that's talking the shit we talking, bro. It's just the truth. And when Reed hit it on the head Reed like that, fucked him up. He, he fucked him up, bro. That's yeah, an Reed intricate fucked battle. Up his whole life. And now y'all taking armor down. Now y'all putting raps in front of real life because even though a nigga been rapping, the real life and raps always be the nigga just making a picture. It always have from the era I am. Tupac, Biggie, all that shit was real life shit they was talking about. Doc Dre, N.W.A. was real shit. I don't give a fuck who wrote it. Them niggas was on that gangster shit. Three six ain't no motherfucker told you I'm this 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 and that. And you you uh. Aggressively talk about these gun charges and not niggas saying where, how? Cause you got caught at the event with it. You was protecting yourself. That ain't how you was sliding. That's how a nigga would look at it. Not saying he not. Not saying he won't. I'm just telling you how it's looked and how it been depicted through how he made it. Ain't no fucking way. He got shit to clear up, bro. Ain't no nigga running around saying truth or not from Chicago and y'all finna just let him keep rapping. Ain't no way. Well for who told you? Once them niggas come in the big loop. You got niggas across there, there, say he been in six years. He more Philly than him. I'm just saying, fool. Shit got to come into account what, at some point. Cola was the was the disaster battle before or after Reed? Disaster was either right before or right after. I, I'm not. I can't I even. Like I, I think I, it may have been right after because after the disaster he battled uh, Geechee. So I think it was Reed. Mark, you know, yeah, Reed was before Diaz. Reed was like two months before so, Diaz. So. He beat Diaz. All right, so Diaz fucked that battle all the way up the angle, everything associated with it. 
I had him beating Reed too. I ain't gonna hold you. I thought Easy got got it's, it's a highly debatable battle. I ain't gonna lie. Now Reed showed up. Reed showed up. That was like the only time Reed showed up in the last. Well, I ain't gonna hold you, bro. bro Him and that God. JC. Yeah, because I can bro, I, I can show up, up when I'm talking to you. And nigga, I'm saying before the face off, he set the tape before the face off. I don't see how it could be debatable when a nigga from your city, city, the, the, yeah. the, the nigga, the, nah, the nigga why, from your why. city. That's why I think we sync this nigga all through the DVDs and everything telling you you not who you say you is. We don't yeah, know tough. you. That nigga hit him with that rich corn and Gotti. Doom, doom, doom. I know, I know, I know. I know, I know. <laughs> you ain't that nigga you say you is. That's real to me, yeah, folks. Yeah, no a nigga rebuttal, invalidating baby. your character is the yeah, ultimate no win. What, what we rapping about? You ain't that nigga you trying to act. I trapped 12 12 skinny walking on water. Where was you walking at? Because if you was born, we don't know you. What was you serving at? Because if we was born, we ain't, we ain't heard a block yet. We just heard, no, you grew up in Germantown. What block? Something. It's gentrified. Nah, I know you ain't trying to act like you say. Ain't nobody over here doing nothing no more. Not like that. This shit done got watered down. Niggas cracking cars and shit. Or, or off the phone and in the car, so you can't act like you protected over. Like, what are we talking about? And I was a shelter baby just like Easy. That's why I fuck with him. He said I had to move around, go to shelters. I lived in a lot of shelters. Five of them. I get it. But my hood still was my hood. I still know what building I'm from. I still know I got blessed that. I still could go over there with them niggas. I still could be around them niggas. I still ain't got no... Ain't none of this shit ain't got no... Ain't, ain't nothing. That shit matters, bro. In, in, in a battle rap, in the street form of battle rap, because that's what niggas trying to use against Drake right now. Man, he ain't even a street nigga, man. Nigga out here. Oh, this is what y'all finna hold now. On the nigga Ben told y'all he was emotional in the scene to the bitches. Now he ain't a street nigga. When he ever told y'all he was big folks now? He never told y'all that from successful on up. That's a fact. Yeah, the hips just go have. Now he said he might have to catch a body, but what human being that 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 that, that got harm done to him? Whether you a game member or not, don't want to do something to the motherfucker that did something to him. I'm just asking, bro. Niggas be over pushing the ledge, but we got to start getting to these niggas. You know what Jeezy said? Studio gangsters, <laughs> street niggas, <laughs> studio gangsters. <laughs> Jeezy said studio gangsters, folks. Ain't no fucking way, G. I wish a motherfucker would try to invalidate my Chicago. Nigga, you know what I mean? Fights I done lost and won and knots I got on my head and this motherfucker, you just trying to act like I ain't from here? She. You ain't lost your mind, G. Nigga, I might know your mama mama, nigga. She. Ain't no way. Ain't no motherfucker way from the pole, from Risky Road, from the guards, 118th Lafayette, 63, 35 Morgan, 63rd and Rockwell, 59th for Hermitage. It's nowhere in these places, in, in these places out west now. It's nowhere in these places that you could even utter up. Ain't no fucking way. That shit hurt. The boy one and three in his last four. That's you it, and that's all. If, I got him to a two five hundred. If he loses, if he loses Charlie Clips, what y'all what y'all doing? You got him beating Reed. You can't beat Reed, bro. Reed was too powerful for him, bro. You can't beat a, you can't beat a monument in the city, and the monument is telling we you we don't know you, but you rapping what we rapping. I thought his we angles, really... I thought his angles were masterful. What um, angles? No, I'm talking about Reed. This is what I'm saying. How you yeah, gonna angle out of real life? You want no diamond. Bro, listen, Reed told me so many blocks, I felt like I was from Philly. I knew more about Philly than the average motherfucker from watching Reed. And I don't watch a thousand Philly niggas. Nigga told me about Pine, Diamond, Woodland. Bro, I know three blocks off top. Fuck up with Reed, bro. But I thought, I, thought <laughs> that shit was, I thought that shit was more effective in the face-off than in the actual battle. It's effective in the battle because now it's a, it's a blow it over. He say, he say, he say, bro. I, I only I, thought Easy's response made it valid. He said, he say, bro, I led with the soldiers and spent with the troops. Uh. I'm the general. It's only, a, it's only right that the captain got to follow me. Like, you can't, like, bro, like, you out. Listen, bro, I so honed in on that battle. I still got bars, froze because it meant so much that I was talking to that nigga. nigga said, watch you, your I'm body. The, we watching you. You. You got your teeth fixed? I got it in the top of two. Like, what? Come on, yo. Hold up. Come on, bro. Reed, what are you calling on this nigga? Hold on. I want to say this, though, because you're talking to somebody who 
my nigga Reed, my pride might be top. Oh, Reed top beat that nigga, out. bro. Huh? Reed beat that nigga, bro. But what I will say bro, is, Reed, Reed was Reed, the first nigga I ever watched, bro. Man, I ain't gonna hold you, bro. In 2006, if you told me Jay Z or Reed, I'd have said Reed. <laughs> so he is buzzing the city, oh, shit, bro. Bro. His no, buzz bro, in the city, bad. bro. His buzz in the city was unlike no other, bro. I could, I could just imagine whatever murder Mook shit was in New York. Just like if you from out there, because we knew who Mook was out here too. But I can imagine actually in the boroughs what the buzz was, bro. Reed was serious. No, Reed was bigger than Mook in Chicago. Reed was bigger than Mook. Like, and and, and I ain't gonna hold you. He used to get with Meek before Meek got the deal. He used to be on Meek ass. Oh yeah, young. I'm on Meek. He used to be on Meek ass. Meek couldn't even fuck with Reed back then. He said, "Hey, Cola." He told he told Meek this was back in the day, oh six oh seven. He said, "Catch me on the block, posted up with the bells at." I see Meek, but Dad, where the fuck is the bells at? Now look, back then he didn't have a bread. That was fucking crazy. Now he ended up getting the mills and it it didn't age well. But he used to be on he used to be on Meek ass, bro. And Meek one of the best to ever come out of the city. And anybody that tell you back in them days, like Reed was like that. So he he was in that whole easy battle with nostalgia. Like he was he was he his, it was nostalgia, you know. He was he was prepped, and that's why I think the easy and Cassidy battle would be fire because it's gonna be similar. Mm hmm. I got things to clear over Cass. Boss, you said what, froze? What you said? I missed it. I put my AirPod in. What you say? Oh no, you okay? I just said I got easy clear over froze. I think clear the promo froze. and the entertainment that I just gonna be. I mean, not over froze. I'm sorry, over cash. <laughs> my fault. My fault. But yeah, I think the promo and the entertainment value and the face off would be crazy. But I, I don't think cash. Beats easy. Now I get what y'all saying. Like if it's in a room, yeah, all his Philly references gonna hit. You, you don't but, think you don't think Froze beats Av though. What you I don't. But you can prove you, me wrong you, though. You can prove wrong. me wrong, but you I don't be wrong. I'm not mad. I'm a, I'm a beat her too. So I mean, you know it's okay. I, I, I will apologize to you in love your love face love if I'm wrong. Yay. I'll definitely apologize if hey, I'm so wrong. You better, but I don't you know. better have been joking about that fucking diss track, too, you came here talking about 15 minutes ago. <laughs> <clears throat> no, on the fuck on us, I'm not playing. <laughs> Yo, what you, what you went in there and did a little drill joint? And I don't do drill music. Chopping that shit right up. Man, let, let us in your intro for Don Marino. Don't you got Don tomorrow? I ain't gonna hold you, boss. Hey. He might not look the same after tomorrow. <laughs> he froze, though. Man. When, when I can see you, though, bro. I'm we can make it you, happen bro. anytime, bro. I'm going right, to you, get bro. the offers as lucrative as you need them to be. Yeah, in the trenches. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I'm super with it, bro. I ain't going to hold you. I took seven Hold months up, off. I'm, re I'm rejuvenated. We can do it. I'm with that shit. All right, cool. Now he want a battle. Okay. Yeah, man. Call I'm sitting, I'm, I'm, I'm sitting right here. I'm sitting yeah, right here. Yeah, I see. I'm not gonna play with you, nigga. Av is going to get brutally beat up, and <laughs> when I when I do it, I just want y'all to say, "Damn, bro, you said you was going to do that." It's so three bro. rounds or one. It's three. Oh man, Damn, it's three. He said, that. He said it's, it's three. Because I'm not playing with this nigga, bro. <laughs> <laughs> right. Battle where Av it. got brutally beat up for three rounds. No, well, I, when, I say, when I say when I say brutal, had, had ice up, for one round. Say, yeah, and ice was cooking that nigga. You can say what you want. <laughs> when I the whoop. That was that wasn't oh, a brutally shit. beat up. Go back to that I battle. He was whooping on Al. Al, my man, yeah. I love Al. That's one Sh battle I would tell him. What, what about uh? That's what about right Sh before Verb called what ice. Sh what about Sugar versus Ash? Silver's ass. I, I, I do construction on that with a jackhammer. Oh, you yeah, that with a jackhammer. I do construction on that. I don't like that. Like that. That's I'm was... talking about for three rounds. Like, of course, he didn't, he didn't have blood put in his mouth, but I'm trying to think has has Adam been 30 well, by anybody? I don't think he's never been 30. Not that I not that I, not that I recall. 30? Had that fight was like in the wild, probably yeah, like yeah, first time look. That's what I'm saying, no, Paul. I don't know. I don't know if Ill Will was ever 30 until I did it. I can't think of me. Maybe I am wrong. 
Um, now it will got his ass whooped a couple times. No, but thirty clearly thirty. I don't know if I remember that. DNA, DNA. Did that nigga dirty? You cost, you cost me some bread with that battle, bro. I think you you cost me about nine hundred dollars with that battle. DNA got right. I think that Froze got the yeah. attributes that could, that could provide problems for Av, though. Froze got them attributes, though, that'll, that'll get Av some problems. Oh, just because, like, he not on no punchy shit. You feel me? So, like, motherfucker going to talk to him. I am going to talk to him, Fro. Literally. And when I say I'm a, I'm a cooking boss, it don't mean he might not get around. It don't mean he might not put no blood in my mouth. It's going to be a rumble. But I'm telling you, I'm going I'm to I'm come out that bitch and they're going to be raising Fro's arm. There ain't going to be no question about who okay. wins. Av got the same type. He got the same, like, punches, like, on high level. Like, you just kind of faced the baby Av, and it was like, you faced Shayna Ashley. Yeah, but see, you looking at that, that was the first female I ever battled. That's so true, too. It was on a female car with Chrome 23. Um, and also, I'm 19 and 4 in my last 20 fucking mm. five mm. battles. Bro. So I don't know why. Hold on, but Chrome, Chrome, not a, a, Chrome not a female mm. battle mm. league, though. That, that, that changes month by month, boss, and this month it is. So for me, it's like, you know, it, you can't move the bar for froze. That's what we've been doing my whole career. Every time, like, I don't know who got more underdog wins than me. I might have the most underdog wins in the culture. Like, I so can agree me, with that. that, might, that, might that be so, so for me, it's like yeah, I agree with you on that one. Like yo, I'm 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 not just some pushover. I'm not no walker. Man, y'all just let this nigga create a stat. Like get the fuck out of here. No, that's a better. No, 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 I can agree bird. with yeah, that. I turn Big K Black T into a Nebraska <laughs> jersey. Like you ain't like Froze got bro. shit from back then. Come that's on, crazy. Bro. Like y'all niggas is wild. I see y'all that nigga. Get, I see that nigga Big Sug up. Then diss him in the same I, battle. I, I, I'm gonna keep it a bean to say if you want to say. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to say, yeah, y'all, y'all, he dissed that nigga. He big him up. Then dissed him. If you want to say you got Av over me, I'm okay with that. But to say he do what I do at a higher level, you're misinformed. I just disagree with that. Ain't that matter? Better ain't that better. You better be careful, nigga. For hey, that nigga, I am not finna be in there. You better ain't that better. Hey, 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 Cole. That nigga finna. Right right Cole, I got, I got, a, I got a, I got a question real quick. Crack about. What up, ass. Q? Like All right, let's just say you got one more question for that cash that come through, Q. <laughs> <laughs> hey, these good questions though, man. These good questions. I just like, I just like, you know, in a in a rematch, like if they was a rematch today, who you got? Uh, Bill or Suge? Seeing how Bill, both listen, them bro, them, right now to this day, both them on they shit. Hey, I have def- I mean, Ice definitely be uh, Av or uh, Ob. But what you just say, folk? That nigga threw my whole shit off, bro. He said Bill versus. Uh, oh, ain't uh, nobody. Listen, bro. Listen, motherfuckers better leave Bill alone. I don't know. Listen, bro. That's what he's doing. Right now, bro, listen, I, y'all know I love Tay Rock to death. And I ain't even going to ride the fence and act like I'm going to be sitting here with y'all to try to act like it was that. Bill won that battle, bro. From the fight, from the energy, from what he was saying, he won a battle. Was Rock good? Yes, he was. He's always good. Bill won that battle. And nah, and if you, and, if you and, and the most defining round of that battle is that first from Bill. So he you can say, if you're saying all that other shit is close, the most clearest battle in that because Bill second was even crazy as crazy as Tay Rock second. And y'all know, and I know a lot of y'all live on this. Tay Rock second rounds is okay, cool. But if you go back to Bill going second, also in that battle, and listen to his second, it was just as potent, bro. No, and, his and, second and, was and, fire. It was second, fire than a this, bitch. This, this, but that that first was a that's the clearest round of the battle. So the battle was so fucking close, Cola, so close. And the first round, obviously, from Bill was the best round of the battle by far. But the battle was so close. And when I watched it, that's how I graded it. I had Bill's first as being the best round of the battle. Thought he won that round. I, I had Tay Rock's second round being the second best round of that battle, right? Mm. I had um I had Bill's I had uh I had Bill's uh second being the um I know I had Tay Rock's third being better than Bill's third. So that gives Tay Rock two edges and Bill one clear round, by my opinion. Now, I'm not mad at anybody who want to give Bill the battle because it was that great and it's super debatable. Only thing I, I thought hurt Bill was round placement. I, I wish his second would have been third because it would have beat Rock's third. You understand what I'm saying? But the.
Yeah, I agree that it was a close battle. I thought, the, to me, the first two rounds were clear, but I definitely gave Bill the first. And I think he won the first by a larger margin than Rock won the second, but I thought Rock took the second clear as well. It's just by a, a little less margin of victory. It came down to the third, and I thought Rock edged that third. I watched that battle three different times, and I had Rock in the third each time. Let me I ask you a question, it. boss. If you put Bill second, third, if he wraps the third, second, that round, because you gave the round to Tay Rock, even though Bill second was good, right? So if right. you take Bill second, which I thought was the third best round of the battle, if you take Bill second and move it to third, do you think he would have beat Tay Rock's third? And then make and then he wraps his yes, second, I third. Been yes, two one clear bill. I put yeah. it a two one clear bill. No, nah, that's a fact. That's so a fact. Placement is fucking. Everything. But did y'all have Bill with a ten? Yeah, because both of they to me, both of they thirds was their weakest rounds to me. Of all of their rounds, both of they thirds was their weakest rounds. So if Bill switches his second and his third, he lost the second anyway. So like you said, his third definitely trumps Rock's third for sure. Mm. <laughs> but it was a bat. But it was a battle. But was Bill's first? Round. It definitely was. That's why anybody who say they got Bill, I don't put up no big argument because it is debatable. But I, I got Rock with the two one edge though. No, Froze, I was saying, but like it's Bill's first round since that's the best round of the battle. Was that like a 10 8 round? Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes. So that if, was a, a 10 if, that, if that's a 10 8 round and y'all saying the second round is like an edge, that'd be like a 10 9, right? 10 9. And then what's the difference in the third? 10 9. But see, that's the thing. Boomer, it come down. Everybody not going to have Tay Rock in the third. There's people who got Bill in the third. Obviously, Cola do because I know he didn't give Bill the second. Even though Bill's second was good, so Cola gave it. Cola gave a third round to Bill. So I mean, I really think that's a pick 'em round. That's how close the battle was. But I thought Bill Collector's first round was going to be in candidate for round of the year, and that's going to stand all year. Like he, and the Mad Niggas is going to have crazy rounds. His his round to be in the conversation for sure. It was that type of round. I don't. I ain't gonna hold you. And everybody, you can judge battles however you want, right? But I don't like people who judge it like a boxing match. The first round already happened. So to me, after the first round happened and Bill won that round, whether he won it by a little bit or whether he won it by a landslide, that's Bill round. That, that round done and over with. After the second round happened, Rock won that round. It's over with. A small margin, big margin. So now it's 1-1. One, one. Whoever wins the third round won the battle. It's not no, well, Bill won the battle, won the first round by a larger margin than any of the other two battles, so we should edge build a whole battle. That logic ain't logic for me. Well, I think if it come down to one round, I think it makes sense to score it like that. Because if you got ten nine rounds on the second and third, or you know whatever the other two rounds are, and you got to figure out who won the battle, it's like if if this nigga got the best round of the battle and the other two rounds is debatable, then you know. Like what? And mm. then you just go by the round. Oh, if no, it comes down it. to one round, then you judge that no, one no, no, round. No, no, what is he's, what? he's basically saying that uh, there's only one clear round of the battle. Right? He's saying the only right. clear round of the battle is, is I feel like the second was clear as well, just not as okay, clear. I but you, I, I, I definitely you. feel like Rock I, got that. But second. I say that too. I don't think the second even even though you can lose a round and still be good. So, I mean, in my opinion, in my okay. opinion, I gave Rock, I don't think you can make a case to give Bill the second as good as the second was. It was Rock's best round of the battle, and he really responded. It, he actually made his first round look weak because it looked like he hit a switch in the second round. Bill punched him, and then he turned right up. I he agree a right thousand up. percent. There was literally a night and day difference between Rock's first round and Rock's second round. Um so, you know, even though Bill was good in the second, that was Rock's round. He earned and won that round. So it's 1-1 one, one going in the third, really no matter how you slice it. You know, I don't think you could go back to the first and say, yeah, Bill 10-8, though. Like, you can't – if the other person raps for three, you can't win the battle in the first round in the three-round battle. Obviously, all right, we've seen niggas get bodied. You know what I'm saying? But it's three rounds for a reason. And, you know, if you go back to win – Geechee and Rock battle. Geechee had a round like that versus Rock too, and it was looking crazy early. And then Rock turned right up and shit. I think that's a prime example of you can't win a three round battle in the first round. Exactly. And to me, it's the same thing with um T Top and Nitty. T Top's third round was so crazy versus Nitty. It's like the world forgot Nitty was up two zero going into it. 
that self checkout made everybody forget what happened in rounds so one there, and two. But I, so I, boss, I, there's no such thing. I agree with bro. bro that self checkout mm -hmm. was so powerful though. Like this, what you gotta I understand, agree. bro. I keep telling niggas. <laughs> I'm changing the rules on this shit. I've been telling you it was a knockout in this shit. Y'all can talk all that shit. Nigga get knocked out. Bro, Rum Nitty was the best he probably could have been. That third round T-Top knocked him out. So let me ask you a question. No, I, I agree. So that right? Right? I, wanna, I, I agree. use that logic. So Cola, me and Clips, could you argue I was up 2-0 on him? I had you up 2-0. And, and, and that third, and third, listen, was, and that that third could have been a knockout. So you, yes, it could. Listen, so you was on the mat. You so on the mat, you no, that's, that's why nigga I'm had to put sauce in your nose. You was on the mat after ARP. <laughs> oh, no. oh, listen, no, well, put you on the mat. Listen, you hilarious. was busy. Listen, you had him. Don't get me wrong, the battle was won. The nigga caught you in the last 10 seconds. Yeah. ARP looked at that phone, <laughs> it was over with, bro. We all thought it was a fact. The bros was throwing ice water on me. Get up. But look, this is the thing, though. I that that's so so if that if you use that logic. You can win a battle, you down to 0 2 it. You probably, because if it's that close, like you said, if it's 10 9, 10 9, and nigga that's what I'm 10 saying. 8, it got a knockout round, got to be 10 7 now, because you got to give nigga an extra point. No, that, that, all right, so you know what's funny? Yeah, that man, knockout, man. dude, you do get me? that extra point for that knockout. Okay. Sure. And see, and that's why I say it comes down to how you judge battles, because I don't believe in a one round knockout. Now, you versus Clip, one of your rounds, it's been a while since I watched that battle, but I feel like it was your second where you was wild. And I'm like, nah, Froze got that one clear. But in the first round, I feel like I edged Clips. I know one of the rounds round, I edged Clips, round one of the rounds you got Clips. Yeah, I think I edged clips in the first, and I thought you took off in the second, and then the third. You know, it was, you, we know what happened. So I had two. Oh, yeah. I, I love. I love. I love. Well, we had a two one. You know what happened, bro? But we right, you know, we know what happened. You know, so I had it. I had a two one clips, but I, I don't believe in a one unless it's a one. Unless you're talking about Geechee and Mike P, and it's a one rounder, I don't believe you can win. If you lost the other two rounds, is it so, man battle over? I don't care. So me and Jay Black was debating the day on champion, and one thing we was arguing about was um is battle rap a sport? I say yes, he says no. And w without breaking down all of his points, one of his major points was we don't have a true scoring system, right? So agree, now, agree. everybody, most of the people up here, especially, you know, the, the, the host and the everydays who watch battle rap, you, you, you know, y'all been around for a long time. We all been around for a long time. Do you want and, and would you think it would help if we tried to get a scoring system or a judging system where it was, it was, it was oversaw and, and governor by whoever, whatever committee it was. Like, would we be down to start making battles having to be judged? And could that take battle rap to another level with actual wins and losses? And I'm not talking about tap the screen smack reactions on the app. Like, I'm talking about we are scoring a battle. Like real judging. Yeah. Um, I, well, I, you can't. I you, think so. you can't. I mean, it's going to be hard to do that because everybody kind of views battle rap. Like everybody judges yeah. battle rap in a different way. Sure. Um, in a sense, but what you could try to do, like I, like when I judge the tournament, what I tried to do was just find like different points of to like which one did something better, like whether it's crowd reaction or who layered their shit better, or like who, um, like who had more punches. Like you could break it down in components like that. I feel like in that that to make it easier now, to judge. Now, Polo, you say it's preference, right? Yeah, but you, I know you watch boxing, right? How many how many times have you seen a fight where the fight is over and two judges agree on the winner, but they got different scorecards? So one guy might have Polo 115, 113. I got Polo 116, 112. We both agreed that Polo won the battle, but we got different scorecards. So isn't that preference as they're still judging the battle, uh, judging the uh, the boxing match? Wouldn't those those boxing judges be judging off of preference? That is true, but boxing, I don't really compare boxing in battle rap because it's like, I just feel like that's two completely different no, kind of... It, it is, but it, the only reason, the, the reason why it's somewhat comparable is because it's one-on-one -on -one competition. And it's a little bit, and, and boxing is a little bit more easier to read because at the end of the day, it's beating, niggas is beating each other up. So you can easy, you can read somebody beating each other up more quicker than you can have yeah, a play a lyrical you, warfare. All right, so Polo, you never saw a boxing match. So Polo wait, Polo, Polo, so this you is never, what you never, Polo, okay. you never saw a boxing match where he was like, damn, that nigga whooped his ass. And then the judges be like, 112, 113 for the nigga you just thought got his ass whooped. 
I just think it's rigged. When I see that happen, I just automatically <laughs> think it's rigged. But, but, no, but I ain't right. for sure. But for even sure. if even if some of them are, all of them aren't rigged. Just man, I don't know. I, be, I, I ain't gonna judges. front, man. I be thinking sports is rigged. I ain't gonna lie. I'm one of those. But some so judges. I think a lot of people. I think a lot of people do. But bro, that's what I'm trying to tell you. What Alex is doing, and I, I think most of y'all familiar with Alex. Um, he he's creating, or he's having like his team is creating like a metric system, a, uh, an actual scoring system, to where okay, punches you score from one to five. Who had who had the best punches? And then wordplay one to five, so on and so forth. Well, that nigga Alex better come get up with us. We've been scoring like that. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. I don't know where Bar guys came from. That's the bar guys, but we've been scoring. That's what you think we calculate. We count how effective was his personals, how effective was his angles, how effective was the scheme, how effective was the regular boss. That's what we've been doing. We've been doing that. Where you think the bar guys came from? I'm just, no, I, but I. I guess, but hold on, but listen, so after he comes up, because that's what, the Monopoly card is not being judged like that because that's not his league, but. When we start, when he do his first card in August, that's how it's gonna be, right? right? But y'all can't bet on the Monopoly card, just so y'all know. But anyway, um, yeah, after the he, metric system, is none of these niggas the balls like. I think we might be judges for that. <laughs> he, was, I got, he, he was hollering at us about being judges for, for that coming up in the. Alex, Alex got a good plan with that bet. You talking about the? You talking about the August card? Yeah. Or I, you talking about I the August card? Yeah, he, he was points. hollering at niggas Straight about um. He win the battle. I'm with that. If he come up with a metric. If he come up with a metric where the fans I'm can vote, tell you that too, and, and you got it too. No, 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 no. The fans don't. The fans don't get to vote. Nah, That's it, what no, I'm trying no, to he, tell you. He's coming up with a system where he has his own judges. He's picking his own judges. Correct. See, so, I'm, so, I'm, I'm, I'm right. with that, so, but I, I want to judge if we going straight winner. Like, if he got a betting, I'm talking about because I heard him talking about the betting shit. Fuck beyond a judge. He's talking about getting to the money. Alex get to the money. Fact. When he said he's bringing up the... But that's how the... That's how the... That's how the betting goes. But that's is he going to have a betting, going 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 have a betting factor? But is he going to have a betting factor where I could just bet outright? Fuck points. I want it like if Froze yeah. Balor Ave, if I had Froze right, outright 2-1, could yeah, no, I bet no, on no, that? No, 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 money no, no, no. Wait, listen, listen. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. wait, wait, wait. The boss, the boss. I'm, hold on, hold on. Because you confused him. The boss, hold on, hold on. He, he's... Okay. I'm confused him. I'm on the team. No, I know that, but I'm... But you, you explaining it horrible, the boss. I ain't going to lie to you. Well, you explaining it horrible, right? I haven't got the chance to complete the system here. I know. Alex is in my inbox explaining it to me, too. That's why I'm trying to explain. Pull Alex up. <laughs> nah, I'm saying he. Well, I don't. Po, Co, he's saying Co, Cola wants to do a straight bet. What I'm saying is it is straight bets. He's using the judges to verify the straight bets. Oh, okay, okay. Simple. Yeah, yeah. It's simple. simple. One, two, three. Yeah, you ain't even got to go that crazy with the expert. Boom. Because Co- but you you will have everything. You can bet. It's no, gonna be I'm pretty just sure. Like money that, line. You I'm telling bet. you what I bet. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a money line. It's gonna be the yeah. thing. But if I'm betting, even on my fan, I bet just the games. I ain't trying to do. He get twenty points. Oh, okay, he do yeah, 30, he can have everything. He, he do, can bet you feel me? Yeah. Yeah. No, no, yeah, you Cola. a straight bet, nigga. Cola, no, for sure, money ain't. Yeah, Cola. but money but as the judges are being so like so, Monopoly, Monopoly is strictly the polls. Whatever the ruin your day poll results are, that's going. That's what's going to determine. Who like, get like paid what like on that card? Right. After each battle, I after each battle, I hate it. Well, it's only a well, hold on. That's just a that's just a and test, I right? Because that's, I don't. But like, I, right? No, no. I think most people don't like the idea of a fan vote, right? I, I get that, but it's only just for that one card because it's not his official league. So it's kind of like to let the fans get familiar with it. It's optional whether you want to bet or not, but it's like a beta okay, test. So I ain't going to lie, because what Alex told me is something different. So I'll, like, he, you might you might be he might, you might be more in debt with this shit, because he, he kind of told me it was going to be like a straight bet. I ain't know it was going to be uh, spreads and all. Like, how you going to do that? No, only for, for Monopoly, it's oh, not. Okay, for okay, Monopoly, okay, okay. No, you can, you can only bet. But how would you do that, though? Correct. I don't... So, oh, well, okay, so that's what yeah. I'm trying to say. Okay, so for Monopoly, you can only bet on who you think will win the battle. They already got the odds up and everything. You can bet a maximum of $500 per battle. After each battle, Ruin Your Day will post a poll. The results of that poll will dictate who gets paid out and who the winner was. Now, now let me ask you a question. Then, Wait, the ball, let have, me ask you a question. Okay. If you see what happened with the Toronto Raptors, dude, what if I'm a battler, right? How do you start? Like, what a system they have in place? Like, what if battlers start throwing battles? <laughs> just yeah. to, like, 
Yeah, and bet on himself. Yeah, ain't, ain't nothing we can do about that. Like if 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 he gets caught, then you you will be banned from the league. Like you won't be able to battle. Yeah, I just think you get banned. Until you get yeah, fro hey, fro, oh, you get booked. You want to make some money, lose son. I, you know what I mean? We put something up. Oh, niggas, niggas finna <laughs> set this up like a mob, and niggas been throwing fights. Like, <laughs> hey, po <laughs> hey, Polo, <laughs> bet ten thousand on me. I'm going to fold for this nigga. Like, <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, look, hey, look, hey, Polo, Polo, that fro was choking the second round. Oh man! Ten thousand. Yeah, and, and you can bet stuff like that. Well, you can, then, well, you know. Hey, well, uh, what the boss? So is he gonna put? Is he gonna put me in as a betting ruin sports man? Betting going. So wrong. is he gonna have better streaker run through the battle? Cause I go through streak through one of them bitches for the for the for the for the fifty. Hey, ten thousand. Nobody streaks through the battle. I run right through URL shit. <laughs> right to the crowd. Hey, right out the door. Hey niggas, that ain't never stumble. Gonna be stumble hey yo, bro. Well, listen, so I streak so right out that bitch through the this? door for the fifty froze. You know how that nigga run on the field and shit, he got to get tired. It's only going to be battles on Alice. It's, it will only be, you'll only be able to bet on battles on Alice Lee and Lips that Lee. Nigga be mad as hell, middle of a big hate I just streaked through that bitch and jumped in the crowd and just ran out the door. <laughs> Midstream. <laughs> Look, this, look. Ain't it the, it's a three choke this rule. If you choke three times, oh, hey, everybody, get <laughs> <laughs> everybody get eliminated now. Everybody get eliminated now. You put a choke rule in? <laughs> yeah, he done. Yep, it's a three. It's a three choke maximum. You choke three times, you done. I, 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 simp I simply think. Hear me out, y'all. I, I simply think that the boxing style of judging is the way to go, and I think the way you do it is we got in house judges, and the reason why I say that is it's not perfect. So if you're looking for it to be a perfect system, you're already going to disagree with it. I'm just suggesting it because, because this fact. is how I look at it, right? I'm a, I'm a diehard boxing fan, right? Now, every fucking time I done watched a fight, Colo Polo, no matter how, no matter if it was a high-level title fight or a mid-level fight, when they doing the introductions, Michael Buffer, you know, when he uh, judging ringside, I done never know none of them fucking judges. Like, he say they name, I don't be like, oh, yeah, I remember he judges such a guy. Nah, that's always a new nigga from Canada. Uh, a nigga be from Egypt. And then there be another nigga from, from, from California somewhere, right? Now, I didn't bet money on this fight. I didn't pay for this pay-per-view. I don't know none of these fucking three judges that they just said, but I'm trusting them to call this the right way. With what facts that they're going to do that, right? And that's a lucrative billion-dollar business, boxing. Now, battle rap. Let's just, and, and if you disagree, that's okay, but maybe y'all might even come up with a good suggestion off of disagreeing what I'm saying. Imagine if we had a high-level battle like um, uh, 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 Tay Rock versus Easy or, or, or uh, Sue Sir versus uh, wh whoever you want to name. And you had three judges, right? I'm going to name them and just say yay or nay. Um, I am Solomon. I mean... Yeah. Yeah. Could you, yes. hold on, could you, could you? I think so. Yeah. I, I, like, I, I like Iron. It's, it's simple, dude. dude. Yeah, I'll be good with Iron. As a media member. He did good in tournament, though, when he came in, too, you though. Took, Hell no, he was ass. <laughs> you think he was ass? <laughs> what? Ass. He got fired. Hold on, I ain't think he got fired. I don't think he could do it no more. Remember, he did that. Good filled in. Remember, he only could do one week, Polo. Nah, yeah. Nah, nah Polo was a big thing. They just some remember? racist shit. He didn't, when they did get it. Fired. he didn't get fired. He didn't get fired, Polo. Boy, I got boy. He got <laughs> fired. Crazy. Don't blame that on Tone. All right, so hold on. I ain't so put that on Tone. I said Tone. <laughs> that was the tournament with Tone Judge. Y'all remember that shit? He said that racist shit, and people were trying to no, cancel. Nah, they was trying to cancel, yeah. him, but he already was due for one week, bro. They said it at the beginning. Oh, That's no, how Goods came in. Because Iron Solomon was only right. available yeah. for one week. Polo. I thought Iron Solomon a did a guy. bad job and people was complaining. And then nah, that, he did a bad the, job for sure. People complaining. But he already was out. Goods was already coming in. He was a one week fill in. Yeah, nah, Iron Solomon a nay. No, but most people say, cool, but Polo, like, no. Um, nah. All right, copy. Uh, direct. Nah. Nah. I like Quest. I put oh, Quest no, in there. I, I swear I was going to say I'm taking Quest, Quest as a judge right? on any battle Quest rap Bodie. stand because he right, actually so listen. He got bars wrote down. He's so, very into the battle. So, Some of these niggas like Method Man doing push ups and curl. I'm not trusting. Got, <laughs> yeah, nigga, just because a name, a name ain't really enough. Quest McColey do a great yeah, job. They got a nigga that got a love. Yeah, nah, bro. <laughs> Me and Quest judge that. I seen them have to pick against niggas against Pontiac. I seen them have to pick foot niggas for Pontiac. I seen them do both. I'm taking Quest as one of the judges. So you got Quest. So. So Cola, we got you said you was cool with Iron too, right, Cola? I fuck with Iron though. All Me right, too. So, I all do. right, so we got so we got two, a three-letter man. 
Nah. Nah. Right, give, give me another one. Give me another Verb one. getting that, he gonna get wild. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> shout out three. That's my nigga. I'm just getting a hard time. Uh, give me another one. Three good judges, though. Uh, we already got two. Just give me one. Hold more. up. Nah, cause we ain't going on two, nigga. If, we, if I'm going off, if I'm going off, if I'm going off three good judges, I'm definitely, hold on. Let's remove Iron. I like them as a pick, but not in my three. Okay, I got Quest cool. as one. One. I definitely put when he don't do it, but I really wish Jay Black broke down battles and Jay Black bro. too. That's, that's Jay, Jay Black, Black is too. like, yeah. if I'm with the boss. If Jay Black really just took, I understand the bias that come with this, but bro, we believe in what we know. You do this shit at a high level. We seen you oh, rapping in the kitchen. We know you've been doing your thing. All I'm taking, I'm taking Jay Black, Quest, and Tone, bro. That's my three man panel. Hold yeah, hold I'm a, I'm a hold up. Uh, yeah, I got me, one battle rapper and two good niggas that's good with words. Got college degrees, very well. Uh, uh, pronunciation oh, I, and all that oh, is is hot notch. They comprehension oh, skills is very oh, high. That's an awesome judging judging panel. Um, oh, for me, probably. I ain't gonna lie. I'm taking myself. I think I was one of the best judges up, in history. Go, up, um. And I made history with that true foe pick. Niggas was acting scared. I had to break <laughs> that down. Uh, tone, quest, and good. I probably take tone, quest, or good. Tone, quest, and I, I don't like goods, but I, if you like him, I'm gonna love it. Oh, yeah, I don't like the way goods judge right, either, so. though. I will go with Jay Black. I will go with Jay Black. Uh, uh, who, who Cola just say? It was one, another one of Cola tone picks. Tone, quest, with. and I'm gonna see it. Yeah, okay. And, give me tone, bro, but then I'm gonna, I like the way, uh, you can't never, you can't no, never just fuck with me. I never heard them do a breakdown. You always gotta go against Quest, don't you? All right, so y'all see this shit. But wait, what? What is this for though? Like this for like? Because no, if you're betting, I ain't judging. I I, I, I ain't doing nothing oh, associated with money. To, hold on, I'm trying to get there. Niggas start. No, no, no. Yeah, list. it's definitely to be a bet. So let me just use Cola list. Let's just but, use Cola list real quick. Hold on, boss. Them niggas know how to make hard decisions. Balls like Quest, J Black, and Tone. I'm about to say whatever list y'all come up with, the 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 people gonna find a reason. It don't matter what list. Even Polo, Quest, J Black, and Tone know how to make hard decisions. Even though they fuck with you, Tone will still tell you like, ah, it's my guy, but. I just felt like, and it'd be real. You may think it's biased, but no, nah, bro, it'd be the real breakdown. He could tell me his reasons why. Now, whether I agree with him or not, he gave me a whole breakdown, and that's what fans don't give you. That's why battle yeah. rappers be mad. As long as he hard not battling. battling. Cole, you can disagree. That's the best thing you said, too. Because you can disagree with somebody like Tone. But also, you're going to respect his decision and when he got the, the facts behind why he made that decision. And you're going to respect that he had the job of judging, not you. So whether you agree <laughs> or disagree, he had the job of being the actual fucking judge. One thing so I know about them three judges as well, though. I rock okay. with Tom, bro. He, but he, know, he had Cheddar be Yeah, he was wild in that Chrome 23 thing. Cheddar man. just was a, oh my God. Cheddar, was, Cheddar, was, Cheddar was just amazing. And it he got was wild in that Chrome. But at the same time, one thing Tone had in that battle is that he gonna have shit for my first round. He gonna have shit for my second round. He gonna have shit for my third. That's he ain't gonna say well, his second first round was cool. So, but in the second he said this, this, and that. If he started mentioning I said something, he gonna mention I said something. The first he liked, from the second to the third, I can appreciate that. Whether he got me winning or losing, if I'm a battle rapper, then someone telling me I ain't like your first, but your second you said this, and the third was cool. I got him two one. I'm pissed. Hey, so I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm pissed. You know, hey, with I got. Oh, yeah, I, I think that's how Quest be breaking shit down. Me, I got Quest, J Black, and French. All right, you said French? No, Frank. Uh, Fran. Fran. Uh, that's who I was thinking of. Nah, friends. 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 I ain't gonna hold your friends. I'm not bad at the way you understand. break hey, battles mama, down. You gotta understand. You gotta understand, nigga. Listen, little friends. A Ward Loso, he gonna get caught in the rapture. It's just how it's going. You gotta, you gotta. He getting caught. Come on, y'all. I think I think the I think the best picks when it comes down to it be the motherfuckers that, and I think somebody said it before. Like, cause them tough picks be a motherfucker, man, and a motherfucker that don't give a fuck about what yep. happened after he make the pick. Like, yo, I'm not trying to please y'all. I, I, I'm, I'm doing my due diligence. Everybody not gonna like it. These other judges can't influence my thought. I don't even want to hear you niggas talk. <laughs> y'all niggas <laughs> messed up none of life, man. Y'all cheated none of man. No, out of what? <laughs> At that tournament where he beat she, nigga. He, he lost me and Quest. I think was the only two niggas that said none of I think. He, he lost the seed, but I, oh, I was nah, the you only said she too. Nah, you said she yeah. too. Nah, uh-uh. Nah, nah. I said, I said shotgun Twice. sug, though, when y'all niggas uh, cheated shotgun sug, if y'all want to say Yeah, with the swan nah, battle? <laughs> yeah, nah, you got that. I, I did. I you did got pick, that. Yeah, sometimes people, you know, pick different. But I do think 
like if you go back and you watch that battle and you like people weren't hip to how she punched so people was not really not, I not never watch tournament judgment. battles over because I feel like tournament battles is supposed to be watched one time. If you watch it over, you're going to be able to be like, nah, he said, but you got to put yourself in the position of the judges. The judges don't get three times to watch a battle. They only right. get one time to watch a battle. I agree with that. So I, that's agree why with I only that, watch so tournament battles one time. Hey, on some real shit, live, live on set, though, if you judge in a battle, if they got the capability to put you in a space like me, like me and Cola was, where, yo... Like, if you were at Cafe, man, put me yeah, in another he, fucking room. Dog. He know I was a better judge than him. I don't know. I ain't got my name right. You wild. So, so look. Uh, <laughs> oh, shit. Up. It was Polo. My bad. Yeah, I'm, just, so, I'm tripping, Polo. My bad. Yeah, you know that, man. You see me so, break so, down them lyrics? So, yeah. So, hey. let's, 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 let's use. I just want to ask y'all a question. All right. So, okay. let's use Cola List. So, we got Quest McCody, uh, we got Jay Black, and we got Tone Bro. These is the three sanctioned judges, right? They judging um hey rock versus easy to block casting would y'all be as a as a culture as a fan base as as paying as, as a consumer would you be able to go into that battle and trust their judgment as judges for that battle to be able to say you won or you lost yeah actually yeah because all sure. three of them judges don't give a fuck about feelings Jay Black don't he can love you to death. He's gonna tell you if he felt like you lost. Quest McCody would tell you, brother. I got I, no, I feel like this, and he's gonna have a reason. Tone bro, Tone Bro would tell me right now in my face, you know you was wrong, right? I can have all excuses to froze. I done been through it with him. I can right. feel it's right then a motherfucker. That is my reason of voice. Like when y'all say Tone Bro to face a black cup, bro. When I'm fuck up, <clears throat> I go holler at Tone Bro. That nigga is very literal on just ha just getting you under control to make you understand shit. Not coming from the regular person, bro. And he's not gonna be biased about it. If you fucked up, he's gonna let you know. Whether that's in the public or not, he's gonna let you know. Nah, Cole, you fucked up, bro. Like all, all that shit you saying, bro. I get it. Yeah, I can see you looking at it, but that ain't how we looking at it, my nigga. This is the point, and these are the facts. Yeah, I'm going right. in there. So if they yeah. told me I won and lost, no. I know it ain't no bias. I, I know right. I ain't cheated. I know a nigga can't get them yeah. off, pay them no way. All that other shit, nah, bro. And it's okay. Now, Froze, I got a question for you, Froze. Let's say with them same three judges, Cola Pick. We talking about gambling now. So we talking about Tay Rock and Easy is a super monster star, star, star matchup. So do you think that any of those judges will feel the pressure when you hear stuff like it's like eighty million dollars on Tay Rock for this battle all together. It, it's a hundred and forty million on Easy all together for this battle, and then it's a close battle. It ain't no landslide. So now you're in one of them right. where each round is like a razor's no. edge. How does that, that monetary factor? Because so you dealing win? with two it, niggas it, that can type no. one hundred and forty characters yeah. in two minutes. That's all true. them niggas, nigga. That nigga tone can transcribe your whole battle as yep. you're rapping it. Yep. He's a different nigga. Jay Black yep. as well. These, that's why I mentioned the degrees. These yep. niggas got BPMs. Yeah, These yeah, niggas' yeah. BPMs are different. No, no, no. no. I, get, I didn't right. mention her for so, take on it. Like, I just want to you update like you when these niggas can I would say that. Well. No, I hey, agree with y'all. Like your hey, let me let me say let me say this real quick. Hey, I I think that when it comes down to uh to like money being on the line, because me and the uh homie Alice, me me and Alice have talked a couple times just about like just the voting structure of the betting app that he's putting together, and one of the things I stressed was, yo, you gotta you gotta take care of the judges, like you gotta. I don't know what that is. If it's a bet, if it's a percentage, if it's a, hey, a feed, yo, I'm just going to pay y'all to come and do this. I'm going to put y'all up. I'm going to make sure y'all, like, do whatever you got to do. Yeah, the judges are being like, paid. That's what yeah, he told yeah. me. The judges well, are well, being in paid. this scenario, when you're talking about the type of money you were talking about, and I even think you can bring it down to maybe, like, actual try to scale it into closer to reality. Like, even if there was... Three hundred thousand dollars bet throughout the culture on this battle. That's a lot of fucking money yeah. being thrown she around. Uh -huh. yeah. 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 Well, the only reason why no, I amped no, it up no, a little no, bit because we got some no, famous no, people that saying Jay Z no, love no, battle no. rap. You also we got yeah, NBA stars. Sure. And that's yeah. what I'm saying. And and hopefully the house battle rap will be able to match that shit. But for for, for mm -hmm. me, how I look at it is, you know, first. It don't. I think that the, the, it doesn't matter the amount of money. If the if the judges. And that's why I ask, do you trust the judges to say right. win or loss? Like, do you have faith that these three brothers that are sanctioned to call this bout, you are trusting them to give you a true winner? Now, if you you don't even have to use Tay Rock and um 
and easy. Let, let's go back to me and Clips. We just said, he called us and I had you up 2-0, but you lost the battle from the third round. That would have been a very... Because his, because one of the that rounds, his a, first, they look, was debating with you the ju- well, the in, the, in, in the judge's eyes. They was the, debating the, that first I mean, Cole, with you. I, the judges probably would have had nightmares judging that fucking battle. But at the same time, nobody said the job was easy. And nobody said it was supposed to be an easy thing to do. That's why we can't find more than three to seven motherfuckers we would uh, put trust in with doing this. So I don't really think you could take out the human factor, boss. The judges are going to feel pressure in a high-level battle, just like in a high-level boxing match, a, 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 a yes. unification bout. When all the belts are on the line, you don't think the fucking judges feel pressure? And, and that's why there's little cliches in boxing that are rules that aren't even real, but they are real. Like, you got to beat the shit. You ever hear? You got to beat the chance to take his belt what does that even mean but we say it in boxing and if you're a boxing fan you do know what it means even though there's no real rule behind it like yo you you can't a close fight go to the champ and that's just what it is and I think that if you, again, if you try to hold the judges to being perfect, the system will never work. You look at billion dollar industries, UFC, boxing, they have controversial decisions all the fucking time with billions of dollars bet, betted on these fights every time they throw a pay-per-view, but they're still in business. Why? Because at some capacity, we are still trusting these people that we're putting in power to judge these battles or fights to be fair. So if, as a culture, we've been around long enough to say we trust Jay Black. We've been around long enough to say we we trust Quest McCordy. He got the credentials to call a high level battle. We trust Home Bro. We know he ain't biased. All right, you not obviously a controversial battle is going to be a controversial battle. No, no matter how much money we put on it, we got the debatables yeah. now. So all yep. we're doing now with the debatables and the classics, none of that changes. All we have now is the judges that actually. All we're adding is the actual judges. <sighs> To give us no. a win or loss record, a winner, a win and loss record, and not in the year because I know I'm OD. Well, then, then you can start putting real belts in the battle rap, real prize fights in the battle rap, mega cards, maybe only three to four card, uh, three to four battles on a fucking big major card. Now we don't need six or seven. These joints just judge. The stakes are higher. The sponsors are bigger. Fucking DraftKings got odds. So man, this shit could be different if we actually get that in order. So check this out. One of the things. Me and Alice talked about uh, because he he just hit me up just for just just advice on the judging part of it. You know what I'm saying? Um, Consistency in judges. uh, There being like this is just one one person, but say it's a whole event. Consistency in judges. There being multiple judges. If you only need three, there should be maybe seven there. So you never know which three are going to be judging which battle. But the fans on the voting end (coughs) before those battles come up they know who the judges are they know that out of it's gonna be three or four out of this seven each battle so yo i know how i know what tone tone bro fuck with maybe i don't know like yo i know that tone bro pay attention to detail like so if i'm betting on a battle man the judges are as important Mm -hmm. as my bet on a battle bro if i if i see and just for lack of better terms i'm just picking somebody or whatever. If I see pick me, Quest, because I'm only picking niggas talking street shit, so I ain't a good right. Judge. Right. Okay. So Get boom. Me out of like, example, so so boom. If I got if I got Carter Deems judging, and then I got Co- Cola judging, right? And it's a battle between Charlie Clips and Easy the Block Captain. Well, you know that third. I I got in my mind, yo man. I feel like this person looks for penmanship and looks for that and it's the same way when it come down to these niggas getting in a tournament like after that first round of that tournament it ain't saying yo but knowing who judging you is important because if you judging a nigga that pay attention you're gonna be like oh shit i gotta be on my shit if you judging a nigga that you don't think pay attention you might not be on your shit so i think it come come down to that too when it come down to just placing your bets knowing who's gonna be judging ahead of like while you're placing your bets like yo these niggas got a judging table of seven to ten niggas that are gonna be at these events these are the judges for this night i don't know who judging what's battle but i know who gonna be there judging i love like, that shit quest and that's perfect scott foster uh is gonna ref a different nba game than tony brothers right yeah so when we understand that as fans yo scott got scott foster on the fucking call tonight you know he'd be dick eating on chris Paul. you know if you in if you not a casual first of all if you don't know about no fucking basketball you shouldn't be betting on basketball just like if you don't know no battle rap, 
you shouldn't be betting on no battle rap. So if I'm I'm not over, I, listen, I'm not, and this might sound crazy, but this is just the facts of it. For, and this for you, uh, the boss. I'm not really over, like super overly ensuring the fans that they're gonna have the best chance of winning the bet. That ain't how gambling apps work. You know what I mean? You trying to hit, and you either gonna hit that bitch or you gonna miss it, and no matter what. You know, so for me, it's like, it just comes down to this. Can we get three judges that we trust? And if that's from a panel of seven, like Quest McCody said, cool, I'm all for that. But as long as we can get three judges where we like, yo, we trust them, the, the, the betting and all that shit, and we can start keeping winning. Bro, don't off. probably only nah, three nah, niggas nah, I owe all these trust at this point. I ain't a lot. Nah. <laughs> I'm just going to say, bro, there ain't lies the dilemma. Because when you say we... Or are you talking about like the majority of a post? Seven. See, here's the thing: I don't, I don't have a problem with none of the judges because it, whoever they, whoever Alex picks to judge, right? I have a decision on. I have a choice on whether or not I want to bet on that battle. So let's say if it is Quest, J Black, and Tone Bro, and let's say it's somebody from Detroit battling or Pontiac or just Michigan in general, and don't I don't that. feel like Quest don't gonna don't, be don't use me for that because that then, question is my integrity on a public stage and my integrity. Well, no, no, is I'm not just using it. Put anybody yeah, on. I'm just saying I have a choice. I can say I can say I'm not gonna bet on that battle <laughs> because I don't think all of the judges are capable of being impartial. So it's still up to you whether you bet or not. You know what I'm saying? Because I, I, there's no foolproof way. Is it, if they get people up there that we don't know, the coach will go be in an uproar. Right, we don't right. know them have from nowhere. Ever, if they get people... My bad, boss. Uh -huh. have you ever bet, have, no, I'm just saying, if they get people up there we do know, everybody gonna have some sort of affiliation. Nah, he was just kicking it with Calico. Or oh, nah, he no, used to rep gun that. titles at Midnight but Madness. Also, and he used to... Also, tell you this. But what we also wouldn't do would let somebody we never saw come from uh, New Zealand and come judge a Sioux surf battle. Right? Yeah. So... Absolutely, point, we absolutely. Find, we gotta find a middle ground. And nigga, we, we don't make the... you pay your bet your money neither. So if you know, like Questlum said, them three it's niggas is betting. Saying, you can't me. bet your money then when the judge will come out. It's, I knew I shouldn't have bet. Nobody, same shit with these cash apps. Niggas be like, I said, yeah. bro, nobody can make you go in and type $20, pay, type a nigga name, NC. <laughs> nobody no, can it, do that. Hey, here go the thing, though, Cola. I'm with Cola on it. Like, we... Um, and there's some other shit me and Alice talked about. We talking too much about just who win and lose a battle when we come down to a bet nap. Listen, niggas can bet on the coin toss. Who wins the coin toss for a hot Literally. little quick dub? Niggas can Literally. bet on, look, look, look. If you, you, if niggas used to you choking, yo, I can bet that you're going to choke in the second round. I just told I them all that. I just told I can, them I can all bet, that. I can bet. <laughs> <laughs> round by round. I don't have to just bet like, yo, if we betting, these judges got to give me a winner or a loser for every fucking round. Right, okay, right. cool. I could, it's so but many you're not going you're not going to lose a money line bet and then be mad at me. You know what I mean? Like you you, you bet you bet Quest McCody to, to, to beat Big Cannon. You bet money line and then you know it, it go it goes to Big Cannon. That's just what it is. Now, yeah. boss, have you ever bet on a boxing match in your life? Absolutely, so, several. I'm, so, I'm a big time uh, gambler. So, me too. All right. So, have you any of them bets? When you oh, the ball's definitely you? a gambler. You know, and I, right. So, <laughs> boss, and I heard she pay her bets too. Was, like, yeah, she pay her bets. Yes, she do. Absolutely right, honorable. So, let me ask you a question, boss. You bet on plenty of boxing matches, and any of them boxing matches, so have I. And any of them boxing matches you bet in, did you ever know any of the people that were judging that fight? Not one. Well, no, no, no. There's one guy I know. One of the one of them guys. I see his name all the time. I'm like, all right, I right, see yeah. right. But but did that ever influence if you bet or not? Right. No. We're, not we're a pros it do though. So, no, no, for sure. But what I'm saying, Quest, is we're talking about a system where, at bare minimum, at least you kind of know a little bit of who the yeah. judge is. We, we yeah. Right. Money on right. We, you don't know who these referees are, but we just you ain't box. you ain't never lied though, hey, froze oh, like a nah, nigga be nah, betting nah, on nah, a Floyd Mayweather nah, fight nah, versus nah, another nah. nigga. A nigga oh, don't know what the, the house, boxing judges is about like. Betting the house though, like I ain't talking about betting yeah. two hundred like we be doing. I'm talking about yeah. niggas up in them casinos putting down ten grand, fifteen grand. Yeah. They don't know. Here go the here go the thing though too that you here go the thing that um that was talked about too like. It go even deeper to pause. It's even crazier when it go down to talking about the rounds, right? Because in, in bat, battle rap don't have specifics. Everything is opinion based, right? But when you betting on sports, there are numbers involved, right? So each round that you win 
can be worth a certain amount. So every battle got the same amount of points. But let's say the first round is um, every round is worth two point five or whatever it is. So you win the first in the second round. You got five points. You win the first, second and third. You got seven point five. So I could bet on 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 Rosenberg. Or how many points? And then somebody else might bet on Rosenberg. Or, five. or they could set or they could set the line at Rosenberg 2.5 over under. You know yeah. what I mean? Type shit. And now mm. if I bet five, I'm getting paid more because I bet on a 30. Mm. I bet on I bet not just if you won. So yo, I can lose. Yo, fuck that winning the battle shit. I want to bet, yo, man. I bet that Rosenberg <clears throat> win the second round. I bet that I bet that yo, I can bet that. And, and still get paid. And my whole point is having judges opens the door for all of that. Yeah. And and another thing, another thing that probably is on a smaller scale, the, honestly, too, it changes the tier system around uh, to a degree. Because yeah. right now, everybody probably would say somebody like um like Steams or Big Cannon is mid tier, right? But let's say t- next mm-hmm. month this judge, this new judging system was in place, and you know, a year went by, and Cannon nine and one. Is he is he mid tier at that point? Right? Depending on who he's battling, because I could just run through the mid tier. Mm-hmm. I can no, just but, run but, through the mid tier no, right. and be a money no, bet. I, no, absolutely, Quest. But what I'm saying, okay, let's say nine. He eight and one, right? And he he got a he got a he got a, a nice solid top tier W over somebody we deem higher level. <laughs> like you know what I'm saying? Because you got to yeah, yeah. now now we got to scale on the odds. Well, damn. Big Cannon just won eight battles in a row, or he won eight of his last nine battles, and he was the underdog seven of them joins via yeah. via FanDuel. Like we ain't gotta speculate. The motherfucking betting odds had him as the underdog. So right. it, it, so even if you want to say he ran through the mid-tier, well, what if he was underdog seven of them eight wins? So at some capacity, again, your record would hold yeah. some weight. Now, now as fans, we do it now with boxing in UFC. We'll uh, take Davis the best, uh, the, 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 the most, the, the best fighter in boxing, and a nigga who don't agree with that would be like, man, who he fight though? Who he yeah. like though? So we do, and that's what builds up the big fights and shit like that. I really think that it could work. Like I, I, I think it could. It, it'll so, work bro, as- who, are, who are the current odds for the monopoly coin? For um, I'm starting at the bottom. So Eunice versus franchise. Franchise is actually the underdog. Eunice is negative one seventy. Franchise. Plus one forty five. What do that mean? That, okay, so so what that that, that mean franchise the underdog. You gonna make more that money that betting that on that franchise that than you. How do we get uh, what how do mean? we get that number? Right. Now now the the mode I was talking about is like, yo, how many rounds do I think Yuna's gonna win against franchise? I think this is just hypothetical. I don't want them niggas jumping me in case a nigga asked me to judge something. I think Let's say I think Eunice is gonna win two rounds. This is fan vote. This ain't this ain't judges. Yeah, yeah. This the fan which vote. Is crazy, is which is scary. But um, if I if I say yo, this nigga is gonna win two of those three rounds, and he three of those. If I say he gonna win all three rounds, he gonna catch a thirty, and he win two. Do I lose? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like yeah, like like in so. Creating more spaces for you to win or lose. That, that's the point spread. Like if I, I yeah. I'm like plus, so yeah, I'm with you. But boss, I actually think that even though it could be improved, I like that. Like I, I was going to say that earlier when you said uh, Monopoly was just doing like straight, you know, underdog, you know, favorite. I think pre battle, I don't like the judge. I don't like the fans betting on who wins the bet because I think that's that, that could be flawed with the money being paid out. But going into right. going into the battle, if we're looking for a way to get some odds, that's how you do it. Okay, Quest McCody versus Rosenberg Raw. Put the poll up on the betting odds and shit, and the fans vote. In 48 hours, it, it comes out. It's like, okay, Quest McCody, the betting favorite here, according to the fans. Yep. Right? That's not a bad well, thing. Yeah, it, it's, a little, it's a little bit more than just the... the um. The overall fan vote that they, they went into these odds. So, for example, Tay Rock and A Ward. A Ward is the underdog. A Ward is plus one fifty. Tay Rock is negative one seventy five. <coughs> what should happen is this. Should, um, and, and hear me out for this. The battle rappers that are involved. Y'all in gonna show. let me complete a thought one of these times. But go ahead. My bad. I'm, I'm sorry. I I, I, I didn't even know I was doing uh, it. My, my it's exciting to get the people I going. Talking. I thought it was quiet. Go ahead. My bad. My sound must have went out. 
No, you okay. I was just going through them. Um, Snake Eyes is the underdog versus Riggs, um, which is a little surprising to me. Not that, because yeah, I got Riggs, Riggs winning the battle. but, but... He not. Snake Eyes not the underdog in that battle. I love nah. Tom going on. Yeah, that, I, that, that was surprising and to me. I, I, and I ain't gonna hold you. Go ahead. What you think? It, at worst, like if you even want to give Riggs a little leeway, is even money. Like even. Yeah, high. it's no way. Know. Like if you niggas be niggas be capping. Y'all right. be y'all right. gotta stop capping on snake. <laughs> if we, yeah, bro. If we put the um, if we put the eyes <laughs> on the fans, that y'all ain't that kid that much, somebody. man. Ain't no way, bro. That create a space yeah, where somebody. Yeah, and then we're, we're like. Uh, if we put the fans on the eyes, that create a space where somebody could cheat. Um, the battlers that are involved in these kind of events and battles like the professional battlers, getting out a survey before a battle come up, and I wouldn't have no problem with it. That bitch come to me. You have a committee that make their votes. How many rounds? Who take what? And like trusted people within the culture. It don't got to be the judges, but everybody that's in here talking right now, they can be validated, but it can't be some online poll. It got to be, I sent this to you because you're on a committee to do shit like this before battles. Like, it can't be just whoever got a computer because I can make shit, you know, I can, I no, can make no, some I, polls I, jump up. No, pause. for sure. No, for shit. sure. I, I, that was the only thing. That was that crazy. Was insane. But listen, I can tell you what. <laughs> I tell you what, though. Of course, I can understand you saying that, right? Like, if it's just the fan votes that creates the odds, that could get a little spooky. But I also think that I don't think betting should be introduced immediately with the judging system. Like, I feel like the judging system would have to happen for like a year or two so we can accumulate numbers and stats because that also can help. So, for example, if I know if we had if we had judge battles, we introduced the judging system, we did it for two years. Let's say Capo, right? Capo go... Uh, 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 eight and three in the two years, right? Well, we, yeah. we got it. We got, and then, and then you, you now you're able to break down the record of every opponent he battled. You know what I'm saying? To kind of to try to kind of uh, measure uh, the strength of schedule. Like he, you know, his component, his his opponents had a combined record of such and such. All these numbers get introduced into being able to create odds, but you need data. So if you try to introduce the betting immediately with the judging system for me it's going to be flawed immediately i think you need wins losses rounds won rounds lost how many chokes has he had like i think all that goes into creating eyes that's that's fair yep i agree the, on this particular card the the largest gap is between chef Trez and billy boondock chef Trez is negative 335 Billy Boone Doctor plus two niggas, six. Niggas Does be, anybody hey, know hey, Billy? Hey, hey, niggas should be negative three thousand and three. So, <laughs> so my only thing with that. So, I mean, if anybody know Billy and they know he cooked like man, that, you can make a little change. My, my only question with that is my only question with that is. Hold on, question. How I'm not gonna put a little two hundred on Billy Boone Doctor. Like, like, yeah, yeah, like okay. how did you get? How you did you get there? How did you get that? You feel me? Like, yeah, now I can understand that, but I, I, I'm telling you how we how we can get it and how we should get it. We need wins and losses. We need rounds won. We you know, we need all that type of data, and that all comes with judge battles. That's all we got to do is make the battle judge. What does that – how does that now – now, here go the money question, and this is some real shit. How does that impact the integrity of the battlers, man? We just had a nigga in the NBA betting on himself. Now, if, if, I, yeah. if I'm up on the on the vote or whatever, I got, I got the eyes, and I throw two rounds – because my man them bet 10,000 on me. All right, now, Quest, he got away with it, but he ain't get away with it, right? So let's let's actually think about what you're saying here. So Bull got caught cheating and betting on himself, right? Mm -hmm. So who's to say if you was doing that, you wouldn't get caught? And if you got caught doing that, let's even say you got away with it five times. That, that, that makes you, that doesn't make the betting system flawed. That means you were doing something that was against the fucking rules. So, right, so how do and, we protect right. against it? What do you mean? It, 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 you can't. It, 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 we, you gotta try yeah, to it depends on what you're doing. Like, if you're choking, then the then the three choke rule covers that, because you only get yeah, three shots at it. Early, you know like what I'm saying? Three times, or whatever the case may be, you, you're not eligible, or whatever. The case you can't be a part of it yeah, anymore think, at all. Okay. Yeah, you can't. You all can't. All right, so yeah. I'm going to ask this question, and again, I am not asking these questions to to, no, but I, I think this shit is fired. I, I had another answer, Quest, but, but that's the thing. 
You think if you was in a high level battle that we found out as fans you threw and all the money that was bet on that battle, the culture's gonna cancel you. Would so how do we But we rich you? already, bro? No, no, but, but no, 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 so, no, so, no, but so, so, hey yo, froze, froze. <laughs> hey, froze. Me and you, me and you about the battle, man. They got you favoring in this shit. Hey, bro, let's just take all our deposit money and put it on me. And do you think that do you you gotta understand? Do you think after we got let's say we got caught doing that once we we won't caught, we, we won't because it's just me and you. Nah, I don't know. To the grave. All, I don't. I ain't gonna hold you. We're getting caught. <laughs> I promise you, we're getting caught. You gotta understand, nigga. If we so we're thinking we're thinking about these actual be, being on betting apps, right? Like FanDuel, DraftKings, or or ESPN betting app, whatever that shit may be. So you gotta understand the federalities get involved when we talk about money like that. So yeah, 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 again, yeah. you might get away with it, but you probably yeah. aren't going to get away with it. So That's now, fair. let's say we do what you just said. Hey, yo, listen, let's just fucking bet all the money and boom, try to hit them. And then we, we do it. All right. And we get caught for it. Again, the integrity isn't questioned on the betting. It's on the battlers who cheated. We'll be casting as uh, Piper mm-hmm. Boy. be right there first. Like, they cheated. Wait a minute. Everybody be on our ass. You <laughs> shit me? I'm telling you, you mute your message because your Twitter going to light the fuck up. You just got caught. Hey. You rock. Now, hold on, bust. That nigga did that pipe boy perfect though. I'm crying. Yeah, well, look, because we're, we're, we're talking about the we're talking about the fans of battle rap. Imagine how cheated your fans are gonna feel if a battler did that. His career would would, would, would go up in smoke, and that that's how you that's how you that's how you police it. That's how. Listen to you. But we rich forever. though, froze. If we yeah. if we if we get up to the millions like the boss talking about, you first quest, and the niggas in that quest saying, listen. They got the money on you, bro. I'm finna put all my money on you. I'm out this shit. We finna put it all on, and I'm losing this shit. Bro. <laughs> like, bro, what's like? What can they Jante do? A nigga uh, can't do Jante shit. Jante we Porter, got our nigga. money already. Okay, okay. Jante Porter, who just got uh, caught and banned from the NBA. You know he getting sued, right? Two hundred and thirty thousand. Know, Two hundred and thirty thousand. Know, you know, what he you know got he away with? Sued though, right? You know he got caught doing it, banned from the NBA, and you, what you think they just going to pay that money out and everything good? Bro, they say the man, listen, his earnings was 2.3 million. The man, they say only man, nigga only made 12,000 betting. So, Cola, you think the nigga who just got caught? No, he made 200 or something. Cola, you think the nigga who just got caught betting in the NBA? I thought something about 20. Yeah, I thought it was like 20. But also, it wasn't that much. The ball, they must have added some more shit up. I saw a thing. Man, that that man got caught with less than. It might, maybe it was 20. Bro, I might, I might have moved the decimal. That boy got caught with chumps and froze. He ain't won oh, yeah, nothing betting. I'm, I'm, I'm about to tell you. I was broken. It was way more. That nigga got Cole. caught with a Camaro. Okay, because oh, first they, yeah, because right. at first they were saying the boy only, they like his earnings, 11,000. So I said, I know this boy ain't did. They, they, they put his contract, 2.3 million he made from the NBA so far. And then I seen the little post with him, like 11,000. I said, I know this boy right, didn't so get look, down for So look, 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 per, per league statement, the league's investigations found that prior to the Rams' March 20th game, Porter disclosed confidential information about his own health status to an individual he knew to be an NBA better. Another individual with whom Porter associated and knew to be an NBA better uh, uh, placed $80,000 parlay proposition bet with an online sports book to win $1.1 million wagering that Porter will underperform. It was one point he placed 80 for 1.1 payout and they got it. Yeah, but his man's did Porter. They say that in the game mates for his gambling's fault, him personally, 11. Yeah, 11, yeah, they said he ain't, thousand, they bro. said he lost more than he paid. Than he, he lost paid. weight. They said yeah. that man was worth t- he didn't made 2.3 million in NBA. So money. let me ask you a question. He banned from the league, right, Cola? He didn't lost his damn now, mind. Now, let me ask you, you think he's sitting back like, shit, I'm rich, I don't care. You don't think that hurt at all? That's super hurt from what he won. I can, so listen, a, listen, so Froze, if I'm doing that, I'm going to bet the house that the Raptors finna lose this game. Whatever the maximum money we can make, I'm finna do it. Everything all that right. they can possibly make every dollar. I'm so, not finna be making 2.3 million. It ain't worth it. I'm a, Listen, bro, that's that's shit that he was doing for a nigga on an $800,000 salary, tripping, league minimum. He was never, he done made 2.3 at this moment. That little gambling money was not gonna get him right. Hey, y'all think they call no, us? My bad. So, so, question they call us? The, the official reports say he made 13 bets and only made 
seventy-six thousand total, but he really only made twenty-one thousand. See what I'm saying? Yeah, and maybe he it was a twenty-one. He popped for twenty-one thousand. That's horrible, so bro. Yeah, no, nah, he was out of line. But y'all know how battle he, he rap is. If we taking like a, total. if we talking about like an ad, right? Y'all know how the battle rap culture is. We looking for anything anyway. So it would have to be somebody. No disrespect, but it would have to be somebody like a chess or a twerk or somebody who who who's a customer slip it up because if Av like like Av versus Don Marino, Don Marino is the heavy underdog versus Av. If Av get up there and choke versus Don Marino, or he spit material that we know is the worst material we've ever heard from Av in in our life. The culture is going to be in an uproar. Nah, he threw that, man. Nah, ain't no way. Blah, 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 blah. So it's going to spark a red yeah, but, flag but, and cause but, an investigation. Yeah, right. and, but, and, and we do that as fans with basketball bets. Man, I ain't going to hold you, man. He, he threw that game. And I still bet the, and I Sad, still bet the next motherfucking day. So am I mad I lost or do I think the nigga cheated? I don't be even knowing, to be honest with you. <laughs> no, but, nah. but but this but this, right. this, this my whole thing, Quest. All right, so let's say you, 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 Jante Porter, right? Same situation in battle, right? You, you just yeah, yeah. got caught. You just got caught cheating, right? We just we got bring you, it, man. We, we, we just got you caught fixing battles, right? And now you right. just got a oh, lifetime man, ban. You just, you just got a lifetime ban from battle rap, right? Right. You think the next ten young boys coming up is going to be more deterred from trying to illegally bet, or you think they're going to be more influenced to do it? Well, I mean, niggas always gonna think they could get away with something, but it'll definitely sure, be, a it's a it'll be a lesson. It'll be a it'll be a lesson, dog. When they see me out here racing horses instead of actually being you. in the Olympics, nigga. There. Well, yeah, the boss. <clears throat> now, now let me ask you this. Let I me ask you this. Uh, just to kind of shift to a little, because I don't want to keep it on just a negative aspect, right? Um, another thing that'll be really dope. You know how you got like insiders, sports insiders, niggas that know what's going on. You are gonna have that in battle rap. The boss might hear my bars and be like, yeah. "Shit!" And she oh, start yeah. talking like, "Shit, this shit, this nigga quest on." I don't know. I might but have sound to. Like you, sound like you talking about the frozen. Go ahead, keep going. Yeah, yeah. Nah, that's <laughs> keep just. Going. <laughs> <laughs> keep going. But but nah, that'll go. That'll go crazy. Like. These will be the like battle rap insiders that can influence betting. They could be like, "Yo, look, hey, y'all better listen to me." And you'll have them people that's like, "Yo, I'm in tune with the community. I know what these niggas rapping. I know how these niggas come uh, rapping with it." And you'll have less rappers saying they bars around too, you know, because you're gonna have them people that's trying to play both sides so they can hear both rounds so they can figure out the <laughs> set. So. <laughs> So like, that's a smart that's thing uh, of course I didn't even think of that nigga smart when he tells me for the battle like yeah we definitely gonna make sure we lose this one to get that little money on the back end cause I'm good I'm a legend already so you know I got four battles see that's what that fucks up no 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 but what I'm saying what I'm saying is like somebody that don't battle like say it's the boss like like yo she, she say yo she fuck with me she fuck with with uh froze and she done heard both rounds and she like shit I don't know I think I'm fucking with X, Y, Z and not motherfucking bet, sh bet shift because, yo, this is where she's saying she going with it. You're going to have battlers yeah, not running their rounds to certain motherfuckers. That's good, though. That's a hit or miss because I ain't going to lie to you, Quest. I done heard some niggas tell me some shit. I just knew one going to work. I'm like, that shit <laughs> yeah. not. Nah, for real, Quest. I done told niggas like, nah, I think, bro. I done told niggas like, nah. That's a hundred. I think a nigga might need to change that. That nigga done got to the building, and I'm looking like, what the fuck do I know? That shit just shook the building. So that shit, I had you guessing, because I done told niggas when some shit went hot with nigga. That's why I don't listen to rounds no more. I used to do that shit and be like, man, that ain't imagine it. Imagine if you nigga get to the building and right. shake that bitch with that simple shit. Hey, man, we about to get to you being a one on easy. We about to get to Imagine if you the nigga that's right all the time, though. <laughs> yeah, we about to get to that, though. That's crazy. Imagine you being the nigga that's right all the time about that shit and how crazy that is. Just like them sport bet niggas, man. It'd be like, yo, bet on the bet on the Lakers because it is. And this nah, that nigga Shannon Sharp called the LeBron bad, stat line. Bad, bad, number for number. That shit was scary, bro. Discords and all that. Niggas gonna start selling Discord memberships for this uh, shit, man. What up, Harlem? But I ain't want to interrupt y'all. I'm just doing a victory lap. Let's say what's up. I ain't doing shit. Talk that nifty hustle. Talk that nifty hustle. I'm just saying what's up with y'all. Just running around. Just signing the autographs of the fans that was waiting at the finish line. That's all I was doing. Y'all everybody all right? Everybody good? Yeah, we all good. You all here kissing babies, nigga? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You better leave me the fuck alone till after you got me, Hey, running around with the St. Louis flag. Just running around with it on my... That's it. 
Man, these niggas done got re-energized for the 18th time, bro. Y'all got Ver Illy. Y'all got Ver Illy Hitman re-energized for the 19th time. G, y'all niggas is crazy, bro. When these niggas start going for, they just don't stop, G. Y'all niggas just don't. Yeah, I see Ill. What's your, what's your honest take on Easy? Hold on, the boss. Uh, I see Ill talking shit and, and, and dropping quotes on the thing. I said, yeah, this shit got crazy. I ain't never even seen Young Ill arguing on the timeline. Yeah, line. back on that FTL shit. These yeah. niggas is wild, but my uh, bad, the boss. Get to your shit. Pause. Nah, I like, I like, like I said, yeah, easy did you know easy did what I knew he was gonna do. I was just it was a little light compared to with him going mm -hmm. second and having more time to just like I said, you know, we got to arguing Saturday night, Sunday. I recorded mine Monday. So he had time from Sunday to Thursday or Friday to just gather thoughts and, and then I put out a snippet. So I just really thought it was gonna be a little more, you know what I'm saying? But as far as like, you know, he took shots, you know, he had a couple lines in there and all that, but yeah, it was it was it was a clear W for me though. Like I, I was a little more worried than I should have been. You better leave me the fuck alone to after this battle. I know that. Who is that? I know that's what I'm saying. I see Froze and Quest. I see Swamp in there. I'm just keep I keep just <laughs> Swamp. Um, matter of fact, I might go to the store tonight. I'm in one of those moves, man. So I might say my say my name, bro. That's just what I'm on right now. Damn. I can't say, listen, since, 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 I, since I might, I might, re, ALP retired, you know what I'm saying? So the, that shit over, that my RBE legacy over. I got a Hall of Fame, my jersey hung up over there. My URL legacy was over 2018 or 2020. The 202, my, my jersey hung up over there. Bags and bodies for the little homies, they doing their thing. I they might were, just hey, keep, is, is your jersey number retired? It's close, bro. I mean, cause I really I ain't gonna lie, it ain't what it used to be for me, bro. Like back then, I'm I'm from a different era. I ain't really have to sit and wait and see who gonna book it. I know I can do it on my own, but I'm really not there yet. Far as want to do that, cause I'm still. It's a difference when you the when you. St I, I feel like I'm still. I still be want to. I'm a boss, but I still be want to be the player. I just want to show up and play. You know what I'm saying? I still. I could do the other one, but that's a whole nother career for me. It seemed like like me setting it up, me like it's just a that's different. I still thought I had a few, you know, the league call, boom, 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 let's get to it. But since I think that's about over, I might just have fun with just on records and just do that and just do bags and buy and just pop up, host events, just chill for real, bro. Hey, I'm just losing. Hey, uh, Holly, you, you, you come to support your sister? Who was that talking? It's Swamp. Oh, the swamp. What's up, boy? What you? Hey, bro. Hey, bro. That's why I look down. Like, who the fuck was like? Hey, I might pull up. Hey, listen, swamp. We were just talking about you, bro. We said, man, you you a good you a good battle. When them lights on, we... don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. <laughs> oh, he's talking. Verb gets sister. Yeah, he yeah he talking shit. That's why he confused the fuck. I mean, I'm like, what the who the fuck talking? Like, who said that? He talking shit. So listen, this a grudge match. This one of them grudge matches. This one true. of the ones that, yeah, all, every line matter. This one of those, Swamp. Yep, I got one for you afterwards, too. You want me? That's why I'm going to drop my dish after I win the battle that night. Uh, ooh, I'm like, <laughs> all right. All right. Listen, we watching. We mm -hmm. watching. I might pull up, too. I might jump in a round. You starting to talk too crazy. Don't make me jump in the third. We crying, hey. bro. <laughs> jump in that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that's going to be good. I'm excited for that for sure. Yeah. I don't know, man. I just like the energy. Like I said, man, the energy in battle rap is always be there. Sometimes you get drifted off. There's a lot of bullshit. It's just, it's just up, man. Y'all know me. I'll be around. Just, hey, just... Hey, 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 Froze. Yeah, Hitman been in my last two spaces. Easy. You definitely lost. I ain't even going <laughs> to... <laughs> That's hilarious. Nah, Holla, they got you up on all phones too, man. You went in by kind of like a should, landslide they, they, on the they, phone. They shouldn't cheat me. I know I get a lot of hate, bro. They should. They got to be real, though. I understand. You know what I'm saying? I'm big dog. I get a lot of... I just feel if I would have put out something as light, like light, the, the, the culture would have let me have it. You know Cole what I'm saying? Colin said he been in his last two spaces. He got hollow with a Yeah, hollow. Clear. Look, look. <laughs> it ain't even none of I ain't seen <laughs> Clear. When hollow left the super stream, I said, hey, bros, man, should, should I watch that inverse easy again? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I feel listen. That was so crazy. Easy responding because. Like I said, y'all know I'm still mad about what happened. Not as far as like even the material, just how it was. Like I just felt like 
niggas got over on me. So when he responded, it was kind of like, huh? Like you gonna bother me at all? I can I get to get this off my chest and get oh my goodness, like. You know, Easy might as well probably thought I was joking, but I was happy. I'm, I appreciate it. You know, he a warrior though. Like he compete. Like he got a battle in two weeks. How you know was what I'm saying? Baiting? Was it was it was it a little bit of bait? Was you baiting him? No, nah, I didn't. I didn't think. I thought he was the last person. I really made that tweet for thinking somebody I ain't battled. You know what I'm saying? Think it was gonna be somebody. You know, somebody man. I just, let's play ball. Like I wasn't even thinking Easy. Like it wasn't even no sense of. To think easy, like easy for the respond. Like, easy, easy responding in five, like four minutes. Like, what you wanna do? I'm like, it caught me off guard, but then I saw E. I'm like, oh, you you the best candidate. Retarded motherfucker. Thank you. I'm like, I'm like, oh, good looking. Like, I'm so glad you volunteered. I'm still mad at the mics. Like, that's real rap. Like, good. I'm gonna let you in, bro. Come here. I made that shit in 15 minutes, bro. We all you son, that shit was recorded Monday. Video shot and everything. I couldn't wait. So I might I might put y'all all y'all names in the hat. Whoever I pull out, just pause. Like that's who next, man. No Diddy. Yeah, no Diddy, no Diddy. Who all on her? Be yeah. careful. Be careful. Uh I love you so much. Be careful. And I definitely and I definitely wouldn't want to fuck up you and bro's friendship, neighbor. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm gonna do though? This what I'm gonna do. This what I'm gonna do. I'm not this even giving John niggas. John when I let it slide. Look, look. I know, I know, I know, I know. That's about fourteen years. Twelve years ago. You dissed me in the air. Will face off. I let it slide. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's my last strike out. But this what I'm gonna do though. I ain't even giving niggas no more warnings. I'm just gonna pop up. With a with a with a with a cover mm. art on my Twitter. That's what I'm about to do from here on out. Matter of fact, stay on my Twitter. Y'all stay on my Twitter long long enough, and y'all gonna see a cover art. I don't know who gonna be the main target, but it might be one of y'all. I'm gonna put everybody named Twerk, Geechee, Quest, Rose, Rose, um, Swamp. Oh, the you Rose. Rose <laughs> <laughs> don't put no Detroit name. Don't pull this Detroit nigga Detroit. name out there. Calico. Yeah. Don't pull this you know Detroit nigga name out there. I know Tay Rock. Y'all these niggas get busy, man. That's what I do. Y'all been lying on my name for a long time saying Hitman Cal. We all knew it was a, it was just something they ain't had much on me. Now I might just take turns slapping you niggas across the face in that booth. That's what I'm going to do. Hey, baby, hey, Cinnamon, come here, Cinnamon. Write all these names down in a hat for me. That's what we finna do right now. <laughs> <laughs> cinnamon tired of you niggas, too. Yeah, yeah I know, baby. Yeah. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, I can't stop that. I'm sorry, but You're right. Hey, Trevor. <laughs> Let me say that. I'm going to watch. I'm going to wake up on Twitter. I have four dish records towards me. To... <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, that shit. We was talking about uh, betting on battle rap, man. Alex, they, we got uh, that Geechee card next week going to be on there. I know you, you're a big-time gambler like me. Yeah. How you feel about betting on the sport? That's my boy, too, man. That's my shout-out to him. Um, I think I think, I think it's, it's great long as we just get the judging right. If we just go off, if they're going to say they're going to go off. Uh, um, I mean, it's tricky, man. Can you understand? With somebody like me, I've been on both sides. I got a big fan base. You know what I'm saying? But niggas to be hated, too. I don't watch niggas win clearly and then oppose me saying other shit. I don't know, bro. Like, I, I, I'd have just been there. Like, That's why I don't trust the app rankings. Like, a lot of niggas try to pull up what a nigga ranking on the app. I yeah, seen nah, niggas nah, really yeah, win yeah, battles yeah. that's losing on that bitch. Yeah, no, so like, so if, you, if you in a battle, um, what's a big battle for you that hasn't happened? Geechee, Mook, and Lux. All right, so let's say you and Lux, right? You uh huh. Max uh -huh. out four. Max out four shit. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so uh, you had three judges um, Tone Bro, Jay Black, and Quest McCody. Mm -hmm. Which, as a battler, would you feel like, all right, I trust those three judges to actually get it right on who's going to win or lose this battle? The funny thing is, I trust. 
Trey Blackwood. Everybody else is Sep Lux. <laughs> hey, I trust Trey Black with everybody else is Sep Loaded, bro. He great, he great loaded on the that third bad, for sure. Was was no bad, was a bad name. <laughs> but nah, but for but, but he did, but he did pay his bet with Verb. Nah, nah, I'm just, I'm just talking stuff. I just know he messed with nah, nah. I like those. Like I never listen. It's a few. I got about six judges in mind that I know that's gonna. It's going to just get it right, like, you know what I'm saying? And I feel. Well, so, like I said, Jay Black, Definitely Quest. I'm not, I, I'm not familiar with Tone, bro. Okay. Like, okay. I'm not, I'm not really familiar with who, I knew he was snake manager. You know what I'm saying? I don't really know who he, who is famous, who on like, like, you know what I'm saying? Some people would say, like, I, I know I've been around. Cola enough that they say Cola had a problem with Verb. Or I just it just seemed like or he was was it Verb? Man, who you mean Verb? They had listen, a first back of, and first and first was when it comes to Verb rapping, we don't have a problem. <laughs> it's just when Verb say shit, it's just being a Midwest <laughs> but, niggas, we just don't allow yeah, when he say know, house so, niggas and he so, get in his I bag. So I gotta I'm defend that. Is, but what you're right, but what I'm saying But is, when it comes to his raps, I don't downplay his raps at all. Now I ain't say you now play, but I'm saying I don't know who like Tone. Like I know Jay Black love Lux. I don't know who Tone. But you know what I'm Tone, saying? I'm biased, so, G. I don't. Now nah, Tone is Tone, a good hey, judge, hey, but hit man. Put somebody who, who would you? All three of your with? easy rounds, Tone to have them subscribe before the battle ended. Now nah, you nah, saying no, he, no, 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 no. I'm not knocking that. What I'm oh, saying, okay. that I'm just not familiar. That's why I'm saying I don't right, know. That's why I'm trying I'm to just, give you the familiarity. of How crazy he get with this shit? He wanted the ones. Familiarity. I just said he wanted the ones. He said so. So, but yeah, but put, um, so who would you feel if you got Jay Black and Quest? Who would you have as a third judge for your battle? Uh, and mind you, mind you, uh, uh, holler like if you like, like if you lost, like this gonna be on your record as an L. Yeah, yeah, L. Um, Jay Black for show. Um, <laughs> Quest. Uh. And that's because me and Quest has something behind the scene. He just me and him just know he just breaks it. I know he gonna give a he didn't he didn't judge one of my events before. Like I know Quest gonna break everything down to the T, where to the point where you can't even say he was lying. You know what I'm saying? So that's the reason I picked Quest. And then the third, let me see. Let me just run down. Boom, 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 boom. Let's see three letter man. Do I, let's see three do, do I, three ain't really never been. I like three too. Bias. Like three I'm trying to think. Yeah, he ain't really had no bias moments. Any of like, hip hop stories. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Now, he know, he know, he know what to look for. He's a diehard. I look for diehards. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm. my, you gotta be a Branch. diehard. You gotta been around for me, for you to judge mm -hmm. anything I'm doing. You gotta been around when I was around. No hey, disrespect. Would you? Would you? Would you? Would you, uh, put direct, would you <laughs> tone, would you bro. I'm letting you know. What about? Uh, what about? Uh, <laughs> what about? What about? Tone, what about tone, bro? Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. What about Anwar? Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> what about? What about Vada? Vada or? Uh, man, none Vada of them is being tone, bro. Man. Oh, what about? No, so, I'm, so I'm with you, but I'm trying so, to name so, people so, he more so, familiar so, with. I agree with you on tone, bro. What about direct? I love the right. He been around. Um yeah. he been yeah. around. I don't, I'm trying to think. Let me, let me fast forward. Make, I don't know. Direct get a look, get a little Aggie when it's KOC flat. Nah, what 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 I'm just gonna say. I'm just gonna say. I'm just keeping it real on, for them KOTDs. Nah. You know, I'm just saying. Nah, you should, I'm just gonna say. I know he more over there, but I don't never see him. <laughs> it depends on who the battle. But what I'm saying, if Tone Bro been around. Why I ain't familiar with him? I just heard a name like what? What he, he was? You hit you, you, man, man cause you you got so Black much Compton. shit going on, hit man. You coming say, and going? Hey, I think you think you around more than you is. You, you ain't around. around. Like you, you just thinking, coming. Bro, in, you bro, been, you, you just so bro, seen bro, and You bro, think bro, when you come around, you just know it. Like Tone Bro been one of the ones. He's from the original days. He from the he from my era. He's yeah, from yeah, the era of errors. I ain't gonna hold you. I ain't gonna hold you, Holly. You not knowing Tone Bro is kind of crazy. That's crazy. That's, that's, what I, now, that's, that's crazy. That's, that's what I'm saying. How I don't know him. That's crazy hey, yo, that you all of us here. You know in Cola and Polo and not knowing Tone Bro. No, I know that I know Tone Bro. <laughs> that's not crazy though. Chris. No, 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 no. Y'all no. confused. Me and Polo the bar guys. We get out of No, no, I know y'all are different, but like all y'all like somebody got put back and forth. Somebody did have a crazy feedback. I'm you, uh, I'm in My just fault. Back I, said, I think y'all confusing me. I ain't say I don't know who Tone Bro is. I'm saying 
when it comes to I don't know Tone Ball, but what, what, years yo, ago. Quest, that's not crazy. Me, me and Tone was on the same radio show at the same time. Yeah, I know. I, I know. Pull on, pull so, right nigga, so what I'm saying is, what I'm saying is, y'all say it was my era, like. When I think of my, I know Jay Black was. I know Three Letter Man. I know hey, them man, angry fans. The angry fans being on the angry fan radio show. He was on. That, 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 okay, I okay. See that? that yeah, that, me, that, me, that, me, that, me that, you, Tony, all had like a little. Okay, from the angry fan joint. I yeah. knew the three dudes. It was angry fan. It was me, angry Tone, fan, and, and, Drizzy, and um, yeah, and, and Tone. Tone. And Tone. Okay, now it's making sense. Okay, you gotta, you gotta remind me a little shit because, like I said, I just gotta know the platform. That's why I'm. That's why I'm trying to break it down. Like ten years ago, he gotta been on a platform. What platform was he? He black compass. He did like seven, eight years ago. He did a lot of hosting. I talked black compass. What black compass? Yeah, we angry was on angry fan radio. We was on. Mm-hmm, okay. We was on angry fan radio. Okay, angry fan radio. I remember. No, I you hold on, if, hold on. If I go, if I go look around, if I go look at them joints. <laughs> I better remember them kind of like I know it's like okay we, I remember that interview. We, we, had a, we had a back and forth about the shotgun shook battle. You you kind of you kind of fried me a little bit a little bit. I got I a little got, bit back though. I got a lot of w, I got a lot of W's on niggas though. So nah, nah, I, I got you on that one though. I got I, it was one one going into the third. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right, for sure, for sure. Nah, nah, nah. But yeah, for Angry Fan Radio though. Okay, yeah, okay. Bet then, sure. Like, okay, so what? I, what, what? What? I probably said the wrong word. What I meant is the people that I know. I kind of can snap and just know. Okay, three letter man. He a big fan of him. Jay Black kind of big fan of him. Tone Bro kind of just didn't, I didn't really know. Like, who he beat? Like, you know what I'm saying? I know he was snake man. I knew he was around. So that's what all I meant by that. Like, I don't know if he got Yeah, like, you mean like what battle he attacked? Like, 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 go, man. Huh? What, what, what if y'all had, what if you and your opponent was able to agree on three judges out of about a ten or a seven or eight? Three out of seven? Like, like there's seven judges, you know all of them. Yeah, I'm finna, yeah, I like, I don't know, I'm finna start, so we got, we got Quest, we got, we got Quest, we got Jay Black, we got Three Letter, man. We got, when Battle Fanatic come around? It's gonna be three judges, three judges. I'm just finna give my, I'm just gonna give seven before I what pick you think, out What them, you think about, what you think about Solomon? Oh, okay, okay, you get a fool. What uh, you think about Solomon? Uh, Solomon? Yeah. Uh, I I wouldn't say he really. I don't think he. I wouldn't say he just flat out biased, but I, when I think of Iron, I think he got a certain look that he go for that he kind of big up, just off the strength of the 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 dialogue me and him always had, or he always felt like writers is just more need to be more credited. Like you know, okay, what I'm saying? So you he think, you think he taking he, got, uh, he, he taking an ill Mac over a Tay Rock ten times out of ten? Easily, easily okay. a million percent. Like that's the first thing I think of. He always say, you know what I'm saying? And I, I could be wrong, but that's all. <laughs> but, but but you know but, but, of, but as battlers, wouldn't we want all the styles to be yes. honored? So is okay. So yes. that's why I'm asking you. Okay, you got seven judges. You might it, it, Iron can be a judge, but maybe not for your battle. You, you, oh, I thought we were talking about for my. Yeah, battle. no, but that's what I'm saying. Think of like a, a panel that you picking from instead of you know what I'm saying. Like, would you be? Would you rather do that or try to find three fucking random judges y'all like? Oh, seven. No, I would. No, listen. Oh, for sure. I I pick the bet the the first three votes out of seven. You saying or the or the mo- four votes? The first of four votes out of <laughs> All seven. All right, so we know Tone Bro a judge, Jay Black a judge, Iron Solomon a judge, Chris McCody a judge, uh, Three Letter Man's a judge. Polo is a judge, and then uh, give me one last, and, and then direct, right. and then direct. We all know direct. all seven. Of them. Listen, the people, the people I would want judge, I wouldn't want to have any arguments with no battle rappers ever. That- I don't want to look up and better see you arguing with a battle rapper. So that. Jay Black don't. Yeah, Jay Black don't. <laughs> Jay Black definitely had back and forth, like like friendly yeah, face off type shit. But like, nah, nah, I'm talking about like far as like. Every time niggas been saying, man, I don't fuck with him, man. That nigga trash, man. We don't bro, like- so oh, that- Tone, bro. Perfect judge then. So, okay, cool. But I'm saying Polo, Cola. I'm out. I'm out yeah. for sure. I, didn't yeah, I don't want to be a judge. I don't want to be a judge. I'm just saying. Then I'm, I'm, I'm done. Judge. I ain't even put my name in the hat. I know I'm no, fried. No, so what I'm saying, and no knock even to y'all, that's why when, I'm, when y'all say judge, I want to see. I don't even want to be a. I don't even want to have no line, like, be able to tie you back to. Oh man, that's why you leaning toward 
if that makes so sense. Then how, would, how, how, will, so, so then how will we feel comfortable with any battle rappers being judges? Because they didn't argue with any fuck. I ain't say, I ain't say, but I, I wouldn't say, I wouldn't say. Quest McCoy battle rapper. <laughs> this is Giffen and Kirk. Quest ain't, no, Quest ain't never argue with nobody. Quest don't even. Man, me and Quest was arguing in 2016. Remember that shit, Quest? But listen, but listen, Man. Quest character, <laughs> that's what Quest kind of go. It's like Quest. That Danny old Myers, Quest was arguing like, with Like Danny Myers. Like, like Danny Myers, a good yeah, judge. Yeah, the statesman at all. Like, Danny Myers is a great judge. I know. Dude, let, let me cook. I'm going to cook. Let me show y'all. I'm gonna, let me cook. I'm going to show y'all that. You know what I'm saying? Like, But what, I, what I'm trying to really get at, what make great judges, you need people that sweat this, like, bleed this culture, first of all. You got to bleed this culture, like, for sure. Not saying nobody don't, but I'm just having to give y'all the, the breakdown. So I'm looking for nigga that bleed this culture. Danny Myers is perfect. You know what I'm saying? Quest is perfect. They like perfect. They bleed the coach. Boom. So the next, if I do a battle to talk about a battle rapper again, okay, the next battle rapper. If I do Quest, then he met because it should be four battle rappers, three bloggers. If we do seven, because we gotta have the sport judge the sport. We gotta have people in the sport judge the sport for sure. But I don't want seven analysts. I don't want Stephen A. Smith who can't do a layup. Like that's cool. He good for the three bloggers probably, but I don't want seven of those. I need the players who got in that field and know how I feel. That's just my opinion. When well, I do level. got a battle with Young Cannon, I might be the most certified <laughs> blogger. I'm just saying, I got I know, a couple mixtapes sure. out too. For, I'm for just, sure. I might for be sure. the most certified nigga on that side. Call it, call it, Tony Two Blast, three shots of the Yeah, that's <laughs> crazy <laughs> though, hit man. Two Blast, three face And, shots and, and the don't, don't forget the, don't forget the ladies, crazy. man. Y'all being a little sexist, oh, no, man. Wait, 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 female battlers out here. Let me cook. Let me cook. My fault, my fault, Holla. Go ahead. So look, look, look. So like I said. Jazz a little biased. Fuck no. She's super biased. She probably bleed the culture, but I just feel like she too close with Geechee. She too close with Rum. She too close with gun titles. EF. It's just she too, too close with the culture period. Yeah, it's been like, yeah, she kind of too. I'm just going, if I do a female judge, right? Miss Hustle. No, she getting into it with Dana, everybody. Like, as far as like, it just don't tie in, right, Miss Hustle? No, Hustle ain't it'll, judging no froze battle. Nah, for sure. So look, so it's like, <laughs> so it's like that. I'm just going off the, I'm just going off the big women names when you say females. So Jazz out, Miss Hustle out. Um, I feel like I think E Heart might be nice. Um, uh, I, I personally, I don't think her. I don't think she. I don't. I don't really know how to say. It. I don't say her name ain't big enough. But I'm just saying, like, as far as when you do the women, it got to be the top of the line. Like, it got to be Wody belts. Like, I mean, I'm not knocking saying she can't deserve it. Like, she's not deserve it. But if we got four slots, if we got seven slots, four for you'll do four men or you'll do three three men, one woman, and um three bloggers, or would you do four men? So what about, so you what about so you what, what is this for, too? I'm saying, saying I thought we were gonna do seven judges the first of four oh, wins. Nah. The first of four wins. Froze is saying, <laughs> Froze is saying like have a pool of judges and then each battle you pick three out of so that what pool. Is, we oh. know, we know, hold on, Holly. Hey. We, Holly, we know Scott Foster, an NBA ref, right? Tony yeah. Brothers. That's oh, that's NBA a good ref. idea. So basically, what I'm saying is we get. Well, I got it from you, Polo. You said it earlier, having a pool. A pan for like seven I did judges. say I be just cooking yeah. up, man. It should so just come to my head. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> but then when I did, like, all right, Hollow, you, you and Hollow, you and Hollow about to have a mega battle, right? Uh -huh. and it's gonna be judged. So y'all know, and y'all ain't seen these. It's not like you, you guys are gonna be the first battle they judge. Let's say they already judged twenty battles. Uh -huh. then, all right, boom. Y'all get sanctioned the battle. Y'all agree contracts is done. All right, it's time to pick judges. You know, you got three left. Three let him, it's seven. So you saying them seven, you saying them seven for you said you saying for a year. You saying for a year, you saying for, year, you saying for basically a year, it's gonna be three judges out of these seven for every event. That's what you saying. I, I think okay. I think like okay. I had introduced it earlier when we was chopping it up, and I think we kind of I meant for it to always be like it's seven judges. Oh, did you, and, did you say it, Quest? My yeah, yeah, you, polo, yeah, yeah. You gave it the polo. And then polo took the credit, too. And polo he, he took, took the credit. fame <laughs> and ran with it. Polo took the, polo, polo took the flowers <laughs> no. and made his own garden, bro. All right, bro. Hey, but, nah, uh, I said that. Nah. Hey, I didn't look. hear Quest say that. All right, it's cool. We both said it. It's like it's both of ours. We just gonna keep it in my house. So, uh, <laughs> so I like uh, the seven. I like the four. I like the seven judges first of four votes. I like that too. Yeah, but like when you get 
if you get it's seven, imagine, imagine this: you just having seven, and y'all done already agreed. Everybody then agreed on them seven, and they randomized. Now it ain't no y'all 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 agreed on all seven. Uh, so you said all seven. Bad, so now I just pull three out the hat, and them the three for the judges, them the three for y'all battle. That's yeah, what maybe okay. maybe the only person that know who judging what is the p- people just putting the battle together or whatever the case is, but they just spread out that way. One person ain't getting judging fatigue throughout the battle. Everybody yeah. judging, but um, but, but that's why it's easier when it's seven and still pick four though, because yeah, then yeah. within them seven, they can always talk. And we 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 got the we did the first event, so now this next three on y'all, but we gonna all chime in because it's still seven of the top um judges and seven of the top battlers and bloggers. So it's like, oh, this battle, we all collectively put our thoughts in to make sure. You never can have enough judges to make sure the right answer is given. So if it's seven, they always come together, but the three might deliberate. Like, it might be, you know what I'm saying? See, Rose I don't like three. that. I don't Why like not? judges talking. You complicating it, Howard. Why, 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 why you don't like judges talking if, if we going to give them the seven? Like, why you don't like judges talking? I don't. Because. They can persuade each other. We just picked the seven best or the three can persuade each other. Three nah, or nah. seven going to persuade each other. Okay, this is this is my thought on just judges talking to one another. Uh, it's impossible to not persuade. Like, like I've I've never seen judges talk to each other and it just go like we just discussing it. It's somebody that think one person won and they're arguing amongst one another until a nigga convince somebody. So, so, I, so to yeah. stop you right there, not to cut you off, cool. Let's just stay on that right there. Pause. If if one person, if it's only three people, mm-hmm. and I'm telling you, man, I don't think I don't agree with y'all. It's it's it, it, it ain't pretty too much y'all can say. It's gonna be like, well, shit, boom. If it's more people that's on my side, which in the seven, if we got three people, just be like, boom, boom, boom. But the other four, are like, yo, you wilding, and it seems like it's a be- it's a bigger, like it's a mo- bigger voice. Like you tripping, all five of us saying this, and only like all six of us saying this, and you trying to be it. It give a better under, like it, it helps the it helps the case because the less the people it is, the more the the the, the person who who judging, it ain't gonna be no. It's gonna be the right answer. Whether he said yes, like he could be totally wrong, but if ain't nobody there to correct him, then what? Y'all, we going off the well, seven best judges anyway. Well, I I, I just saying that what the power of persuasion come into play. You know what I'm saying? Like, and the power of influence. Like, there's somebody that's going to listen to something Quest McCody say before they'll listen to something XYZ say. So they may hold my opinion a little more value than the next person and you as well. They might be like, well, fuck it, man. Hitman, think it, fuck it. I think it too. When independently they thought was different. So I I think it could. I I get what you're saying, though. Like, Mm. how long would you give them to 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 do that would you get them like an extended period where they can go and break down this battle amongst one another for five ten nah, minutes no nah, i was thinking like, yeah i was thinking when it's on the spot the more it is the better when we talking about breaking it down right out of the battle 10 minutes seven beat three you know what i'm saying and what i'm saying only reason i say everybody is because just say this next three i randomly pick is three bloggers the battle rappers are already kind of mad because ain't no battle rappers even judging. The bloggers can see something totally different. Than- well, we've seen Cal and John John fuck this shit up. I ain't gonna lie now. Let's get to that. I was gonna I was gonna be cool, but when y'all start getting at us, John John and Cal was up there fucking shit up. If yeah. it wasn't for questioning them in the back, getting shit right, and the battle rappers shit would have been a little rocky. They were, they were, I'm gonna yeah. keep it a hundred hit, man. Yeah, you gave your guys what, a try. They what, what, they, what, they ain't look what, too good. They was up there. They was up there drinking and See, talking, doing rounds. They, listen, they, no, they listen, ain't had no balls. But that's what I'm saying. Let me tell you the difference. If okay. we already agreed that Quest and Danny take the shit serious, and they gonna, rem- we talking oh, about two true. different. We talking okay. about we Calico is, was Quest drunk off that henny. John John probably <laughs> high. Not saying they judges <laughs> was still off, but they probably ain't. I ain't gonna say they took. I don't. I don't know. But we. I'm telling you Danny, what we watched. Now I'm saying, but I'm saying if we talking about Danny Quest, we talking about somebody nah, Danny and Quest that, ain't, that ain't gonna drink, sure. that's gonna be even me for real. Like I don't never like if I had to come down and sit down and really break, I wouldn't. But if I yeah, I depended on me to sit down and watch <laughs> this shit and break it down, I'm gonna sit down and I'm gonna really break it down. That's my job. 
Danny, a how you feel about like, Henny Man? He put his resume in the in, in the chat. How you yeah, feel about just, Henny Man? I, I just feel he got too many. He got too many arguments with battles. Okay, okay. You know, Henny, Henny, all... Henny Man is what? Huh? As a judge, okay. nigga, oh, he threw his resume in the thing. He said, "Respected brand, nine years in the game, nah, six nah, and a half in media." Listen, I think nah, that, okay. I, listen, I, listen. I, his resume probably there. I'm telling you, a lot of rappers are gonna do what Rose the Froze just did. That's because that's just me off the hey, Froze, You do look like Pete Rose though, so that shit ain't even fought. Like you look like Pete Rose, no bullshit. So he said, "Rose, that shit had me tripping." Bro, I was looking like Pete Rose. Rose. I don't have nothing personally. I would y'all decline what? judging if you know you can't, you or none of your family, none of your immediate family can bet on battles if you a judge? Would you decline it just so you can partake in the bidding? Not if um, think, that's why you, you gotta can, just take boss, care of the judge. Yeah, I want to say, boss. I'm not gonna lie to you. We talking about actual betting and betting apps getting involved in this. The judges gotta be paid handsomely. I, th I think they should be paid. Nah, that, like, that's why I just said. As far as John John them, they probably you know I don't know what the circumstances are, but if this was gonna be that and niggas are paying you, I know for a fact Bad Robert's gonna beat up with the notepad or you know what I'm saying with their phone. I know they're gonna take it as a job. Like this something yeah. else. This ain't just hey man, we need y'all to judge. Come fuck with us. This a job. So you know think what I'm saying? Think about how all of them did blogging when caffeine was Dropping them checks every month. Niggas was on on time, making flyers, dog. A hundred hours shows. on the dot, like one play. Like <laughs> niggas was. That's what I'm saying. It's just different. Yeah. I mean, I I'd, I'd just had a two seasons of real life judging from Battle was pulling up Quest, Tay Rock, Shook, John John, Verb. Like I really, I know how to be done for real. Cause niggas was have to judge with fifty thousand on the line. I'm mm -hmm. watching niggas judge battles. For real, no drinking, no smoking, breaking down bars. For two seasons, they done gave away a hundred thousand dollars to the winners of real life judges. And I and I know the reason why I say seven over three, because when that shit get difficult, it's always good to, especially when you, if we already picked the seven. I ain't just saying the yeah. three, just random three to go oh, bring four more. And hey, you was listening, and hey, you come here. Like, nah, not that. If we already, <laughs> if we already got the set seven. And we all know they all not gonna be biased and really do what they gotta do. We might as well just use that them seven voices because the shit gonna get real with niggas money. Niggas ain't trying to hear nothing, bro. I just lost twenty thousand dollars on a bet and I got an L on my record because this person top of some. Well, I just don't feel like performing <laughs> is really a good attribute. Oh boy, had rhymed three syllables. You know what I'm saying? Like we want, but we want the real shit. So I want to make sure we need as many voices as possible to come make the right decision. That's yeah. just my honest okay, opinion. Okay, so so okay, so y'all got if I if I okay, so if, if being honest from that impact of what you saying and not niggas I know cover the game and go know it top to bottom from media side, that's mm -hmm. what I'm telling you. I'm taking Jay Black, mm -hmm. Tone Bro, and that's when I add in friends because I know he know every analytic. The nigga can hear another oh, nigga friends. got the BPMs. He can type everything. If friends. you going seven, I'm adding friends because I know he's gonna know every stat leading up. Yeah, he's gonna know sure. the storyline. Yeah. He's gonna, he gonna, he gonna know, know everything. Them he three bloggers, I'm putting on a panel to judge something. Now I'm taking that with Quest Danny, and you can have two other battle rappers. I know them three judge, them three uh bloggers. Or, or if you take four, I'm adding my boy Polo. Cause I don't think nobody breaking shit down like us. We the bar guys. Yeah. I'm just being honest. I ain't gonna lie. I like I ain't gonna lie. I, I, like I said, I, I respect that. Only other bloggers that I know that I, I can't really see put bias and be like Battle Rap Fanatic. Like, I, I don't know. Like, I never seen him. He might be doing a reaction video doing it, though. So he might not be ready. I'm just being honest. <laughs> I'm just saying. He I'm, might be the one, the, the one, I'm the just one, saying. The, one, the ones I'm just trying to, I'm just going off the top of my head on some, I just know for a fact that I've just seen him over the last seven years just not be biased. Just call it how they see it. That's all I'm saying. Like, he might not be one. This what I'm saying. They were saying he, he was making a... They said he got accused being biased in the tournament with the rum nitty. He was doing a ah, ah, ah. I'm just saying what they said. He, I'm, he, he, uh, he, he cool. EFB? They yeah. say, they, basically, they say he well, EFB. I don't know if he cool with them, but I, I know in the battle, he was doing reaction videos while he was live judging. That was like a big thing during the battles for serious oh, versus rum nitty. Yeah, for serious oh. versus rum nitty. You know, that was a big thing. Oh, okay. Well, shit. Well, see, that's what I'm saying. Well, now, I, other blog with friends. But I ain't seen them biased, though. I'm going to keep it. I ain't seen them on no super behind. But besides that I just moment, think for Nitty. Besides that, I, I ain't seen them. I ain't seen them biased. Yeah, oh, only oh, one. Yeah, only. It can't be one. I can't think of you. If it's one, that's kind of, ah, like, fuck. But I'm not, like I said, I mean, I that can go into when they was hating on Nitty, too, though. You know, just the fact he had him winning, he'd be around them niggas. And Nitty was still on fire, but I get it.
Yeah, okay. That was his well, yeah, one. Yeah, Fran, I forgot about yeah. So yeah, yeah. Fran's Fran gonna keep it on. He got he know the stats. He followed the game. He ain't half assing. That's one thing you could get from a Tom J Black and, and, and Friends for sure. I don't think I don't think Piper Boy block bias either. I mean, Man. but he did have back and forth. Well, I probably Man. wasn't watching enough battles for no breakdowns, bro, and no judging. I'm That's just true. being honest. Hey, if yeah. anytime you try and meet up Fuck with a battle rapper, he's funny. Fight, but... You can't, you can't. Yeah, you he's trying to like, fight a battle you, rapper. <laughs> you can't, yeah, it's true. It, it goes string along. <laughs> like, you got to do it with too many, too many battle rappers. Not saying, I know it was old, but it's still like, ain't, it's not me battle rappers. That'll be mad if Pipe Boy was the judge. Not even just saying y'all picked him. Just do a, you know what I'm saying? Like out of 20 battle rappers, 12 will probably be like, nah, bro, just go on the strength. They probably feel like Pipe Boy don't fuck with him. Just off his blogs, probably. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. that's that's what I'm saying. Like, I just think he unbiased. I just that's the unbiased factor. I don't think he ever got a like loyalty to no battle. No, I don't yeah. think he no, I don't think yeah, he biased. I, think, I, I just don't think he don't do that type of I, don't, I ain't never seen them in that lane of battle rap where I think the blog was he really was getting intricate on breaking yeah, not me. Yeah, yeah, ball, yeah, ball, yeah, ball. He may can. I, 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 I said he can't. Uncle Rob. I just never seen it. No. <laughs> I don't think I don't think Uncle Rob break it down, break the bars down. It's not a like million dollars worth of rhymes. Uncle Rob was a judge before and it's not uh, a million dollars worth of rhymes, hit man. I think yeah, you know. I think. Yeah, but I think, I, but somebody said when it come to bed, how do y'all, how do y'all think that uh, it, cause it's, it's still retroactive, right? So if somebody, if he get come, if after the battle it gets exposed that somebody recycled a whole round, I mean that shit wouldn't matter. It's all on the spot, right there. Yeah, it's on the spot. And that's, I mean that's, that's way, just, nigga better that, know that, right that, there. Why, yeah, that's why. That's why you would need them seven. <laughs> That's why you would need them seven to kind of historians. Yeah, them, you that 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 shit. You need matters. them Francis. You need them Tongs. Them yeah, we, yeah, you I'm need them. We need them Francis. Need, need them J Blacks. Them I'll niggas gonna know friends. everything yep. for sure. For sure. I don't, I don't agree with the France choice at all. This, this is for the betting, right? Nah, Francis. No, no, nobody no more than his and story and history. Like right 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 who don't who don't agree with the France and why not? But I think I, I don't I, know what Capo talking about. Like, I feel like when it comes to Let's Talk Battle Rap, they just that that whole staff is more in favor of the new school. You feel me? And you know, I say that, and I, I'm sometimes I get in favor of that. We talking about you talking about the staff or friends, bro? We talking about one player right now. You talking, talking about, about all of them? I'm talking, I'm talking we about talking about friends as a general, bro. Each, I'm talking about each friends. single because I think member. Tata do a good job as well. Like I don't think Man, Tata is bad. Friends gonna call that shit down the middle, and he gonna have everything. You ain't gonna be able to say. I ain't gonna be able to get on the stage and say not you. Like at Fury, that shit right. was 2010. I'm not. I know that's a big right. ball. I'm just saying, like it's no. You ain't getting no bar past him. Ain't no recycle getting past him. You ain't gonna be able to even do the same PG two step in front. Like he gonna know it. That shit he gonna, gonna matter it. when it come to betting. I swear it, that shit gonna matter. It and matters, he's right bro. Top of the list. When and he's top of the agree. list with that shit. That's, a, that's a fact. I just think you know. I think the whole staff is just in favor of the new school a lot. I would, nah. I would think that all today decision. I, think I mean, think, we we all yeah. definitely fight for evolution. They fight for it more because right. it's a part of battle rap. You need right. the new right. cycle of what we love because if Hitman and them do decide to hang this shit up like Verb threatened us in two days, if they do, folk, we might be fucked because a lot of them shit on the new niggas. And if who ain't imploring them like the Tone Bros, new artist spotlights right. and niggas like right. that, that's why I said Tone. These niggas in the crates, bro. You can't be mad at niggas in the crates because we was one moment in the crates for the Hitmans and Surfs and all these niggas when they was. At that point, just getting in and and said what and coming to New York, and they was them niggas at one time. It wasn't as big, but we was all pushing that shit. If, if they not, who is? They pushed you, nigga. You one of the new guys. That's what I said. Why I you said, acting I old, said, nigga? Well, Capo, but Capo, can you name or something specific? Like that he friends and like friends. I know like friends. Friends <laughs> up and up. I said, up. Been you got some specific. I said I've been a friend. Wait, but it's a tournament league. coming up, or this is but like do you have a specific example of something that friends did? coming up with Alex, fool. I, I feel like I don't have a clear oh, yeah, I, I don't have a clear and cut example. I just feel like you have a Eunice, you have a uh, you have a Los Prime, you have anything along them Fire lines. An Apple, an Apple. You have any? Fire nigga though. No. Yeah, if you have anything them, along <laughs> them three niggas the is do, listen. I'm gonna see, say you, listen, you Capo, naming the best you name, of the you new era. Three niggas that ain't around here running around, and we know them actually off their craft. See, that's what niggas gotta understand. We know Eunice, we know Oppa, we know Low Supreme, all new niggas off their craft. We don't know them from this like Hitman said, arguing and picking fights, and he gotta do a super promo. We know that them niggas are good 
rappers young as fuck, bro. The newer class, them three of the niggas that's I was already on I battle headline and shit, winning championship. Eunice, rookie of the year. Los Prime, another nigga on that I battle coming up in that. It get real crazy, bro. These niggas we know for their raps. What you really want to know a nigga from? Nah, I, I agree with that. You bro. have to campaign those type of that. niggas, bro. That ain't nothing wrong with that. No, I'm not. I'm not wrong with the campaign. I'm just. I'm just saying. I think look at the accolades the I just gave you with the niggas champion on the whole league from spaces. You got Eunice coming this motherfucker. He getting that getting verb recognition, and hustle battles, and everybody recognizing his pen coming up. Rookie of the year. You got Los Prime, another one coming out the shadows. Young guy doing hey, his think, work without all niggas, the controversy and all that, bro. That shit's dynamic. I think niggas heard him wrong. I think he said that. Didn't you say that they they lean more toward the new? Yeah, that's, that's, that's all I'm saying. I'm not saying yeah. like. I, but I, that I, ain't got nothing to do with them judging two yeah. vets, though. Quest. I'm not saying he right. No, I'm just I'm saying, saying I want to be clear what it is. Saying, what when it said, is a Eunice, or breaking no bars it, down. I think when it is a Eunice on a uh, so so we can't so they can't judge a, a, a vet a rookie versus vet card. Hey, I, 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 I wouldn't want them to. I wouldn't want them to. Okay, Me okay. Thanks for the input. Keep that keep that in mind. Man, he knew it. he knew up. it, man. Nah, nah, this nigga, nah, nah, nah his man. Friends, friends have been around long. This nigga been around twice. I know that. Listen, I know that. I'm this nigga trip. No, I pick friends. I know. Listen, friends, and then worst come to worst. If it's if it's that close and it, it where it, where that matters, if if, if he got you know, it, just what it is what it is. Like, hey, bro, France, France was at that a listen. France, money, France, so France, France was at that a verb sb nigga. A lot of niggas can't even tell you that, but hitman. <laughs> France was at that hitman sb when the a angels verb. was going in the sky. Ask him that. That nigga Capo wasn't even thought about rapping. That nigga was running around now for what was good dreads, a fade. <laughs> <laughs> nigga probably had table dreads at that time when that nigga friends was out there. Who he talking about KB? He wild. <laughs> <laughs> I oh, pick friends. I, I, I pick friends. Shout out friends. Yo, Kevin, he's crazy. Friends, yeah, friends, friends, bro. Friends want me some money, so I ain't saying it was hell I'm just shout strictly speaking on the integrity of, of, of wages and shit. I ain't talking on nothing else, you know? Like, I fuck with friends. Yo, Hitman, you you. Uh, man, cool, I, know, I know you probably gonna get out of here. So we got you heard that easy dish. I don't know if you spoke about it yet. My fault if you did. Yeah, yeah, we did. We spoke about it earlier. Yeah, I heard. Okay, it. okay. Mm -hmm. okay. How, who you 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 taking that one oh? Yeah, yeah. This is my victory lap. That's why I came in here. Pause. I just came here. I was I was signing shoes and shit, running around. You know, how to, had the St. Louis flag around, running around the track, just <laughs> waving to the cameras and shit. I needed that. A little revenge for me, man. I ain't like how they did with the mics and shit. So shout out to everybody, you know. Ain't gonna look good on camera. Is it that that that, that, that dish pack look good on camera? Y'all <laughs> <laughs> yeah, gonna, gonna do a rematch? Nah, we was just listen, and that's another thing, man. I see a lot of comments like, oh hey man, still mad and he mad because he's just off the blue, man. Easy ask for that, bro. I I I tweeted a bar that was from mainstream or any other battle rapper. Like, man, whoever wanted wants some wreck. Let's get in the studio. I'm feeling good. Whoever whoever say my name, let's play ball. Easy being a competitive nigga he is. Shout out to him. You know, he competitive. He said, what you want to do? He, he So, you know what I'm saying? That's what put the target on Easy. Like, you know, we ain't got nothing coming up, no rematch or it ain't nothing like that. It was just two niggas who, like, he got a battle coming up and he jumped in. That's that's what I respect that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? He jumped in that ring. So, yeah, this just was some shit like, you know what I'm saying? He knows. He, <laughs> so, if, so if Mooka Hustle step outside with a diss song coming at you, you, you back outside? I mean, you know, I'm always like I, I shot it. I first of all, I done shot it Mook twice and two. He said he breaks. might just. He said he just shot might just start dropping you know a saying? cover I might, on Polo. Yeah, like he like said he ain't playing with these niggas. He said he just on that timing. <laughs> Nigga yeah, get on his yeah. nerve. He gonna drop a cover art in this yeah, zone. I every, like that. I, I just might. Y'all gonna wake up on a random Wednesday and see man this drop it at eight. Like I, I might be on that type time, man. You know what I'm saying? So Miss Hustle, Miss Hustle, no, Miss Hustle, know what's up with me, man. <laughs> no, bro. Like, Miss Hustle, I'm just sitting doing that thing. I'm a hitman, though. I'm supposed to want to kill in the tux. It's me, bro. <laughs> what the nigga's name? Easy to. I'm here. I'm here. Move my, move my drop something, man. Man, I mean, stop it, man. man. Have anybody ever even heard from him? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. oh, hopefully he cleaning up. Hopefully he cleaning up. Hopefully know, he cleaning up. I don't know where he at, man. I'm good. Well, <laughs> oh, boy, I go, boy, I go to the boy. He, boy, he, he didn't leave me alone. 
Nigga been leave me alone right That'd now. That'd be crazy. Man. Move this drop up. Hitman this. Like, you ain't yeah. here for that nigga in a few months. Yeah, and I'm Y'all telling you now. I'm gonna make T-Rex get off the couch in a minute. You know, Rex love this type of shit. Rex, yeah, Rex hoping the nigga know, say his name. Rex with a K. I know. <laughs> Rex, wait the rap. I know. Uh, you know <laughs> what? Niggas are gonna play with me, Cole and Polo. Yeah, <laughs> I know, just to get you know, I'm feeling so good. Rex might be next. I don't know what. Yeah, Rex. Right nah, right 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 hey, 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 Cole and Polo, that nigga want to play with me. You know, Rex <laughs> get right out there with the color day. That nigga Rex say. That nigga Rex say. Man, them niggas, man, you let them niggas do that to you, man. That, man, that wild now shit would have been shot the fuck up if that was me, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking with Rex, man. I'm fucking with Rex. Bro, that's what I'm saying. The rappers ain't free to wage. The real rappers would be out here stepping right now. The yeah, real rappers. Man, you know we got to get the you know, real man, rappers out here, man. Yeah, you know what I mean? Surf did this 2010 Yeah. Like that. yeah that, yep. shit, that shit, we just fucking around. Like, hey, I'm from that era, man. That's why I don't know why they don't respect me and keep saying... That rapping shit, I don't, I don't know what I don't know who the fuck they confused me with, but this is second nature to me, bro. Like, it's another. I might let me call my engineer. I might go to the lab tonight. This blog is Colo Polo. You niggas might. You know what? All right, bro. What the, hey, hey, hey Hitman, I don't right? think you wanted this. Me, you know, I fire back. Look, 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 you know, I'm not. I'm just saying. I'm a different blog. Hey, you know what? You I'm know what? Saying, man, you, you know what? I'm gonna. What? You know nah, what? Don't diss me, man. You know what? Yeah, I'm waiting for this flag. Don't diss me. I'm gonna be next. You yeah, know I what? Man. That's a great idea. Nah, you diss me. I'm getting the booth. Let me see. Polo, Polo, J Black, Three Letterman, Piper Boy, um, Friends, Fanatic, uh, Unbot. Yeah, you know what? I'm excited. What beat y'all want? What beat you niggas want? What beat you niggas want? I'm gonna show y'all so I'm gonna show y'all so I'm gonna get crazy. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna let y'all know now. Nah, that'd be I'm lit. Gonna, I'm finna have some fun. Yeah, listen, I'm I'm just in a good mood, rap mood. The blog is this coming soon. I'm finna, I'm finna pick, I'm finna pick, I'm finna pick the names. I'ma have a fan send me the five names who who I should really go at. You know what uh, I'm saying? Man, hey, you I'm, know these hate niggas, man. They probably <laughs> <laughs> Get okay, Cola yeah. out of here immediately. <laughs> Cola gonna be the name number one. Niggas gonna be. <laughs> <laughs> Get him out of here now, it man. Don't wait. Oh, uh, it's up. Yeah, that's a good idea. My bad. Let, no. let me call my engineer, man. Let me just brainstorm and see if I if I if I think of the first eight bars within the next ten minutes, you, y'all niggas are dead. If I think it's something gonna flow right now, I just think of the beat right now. That's gonna be fun because I owe y'all. Some of y'all niggas be having me. To one other way and shit, man. So all you niggas, bro. Oh, the boy. Oh, space in this. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I nah. say, ooh. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> hey, the boss. I might know you STL, but you, what you yeah, get? Now I might throw a shot at you. I ain't gonna lie, that nigga young Kenneth did tell me some wild shit, like stomach shot. I had a doctor really trying to close his space. You so know I ain't gonna lie, that nigga man, Kenneth tried no, to lie. You know the who, who said that? Who said that? Nigga, that nigga Kenneth young said, Kenneth. Cola, a stomach shot. I had a doctor really trying to close his spaces. I said, Ooh. <laughs> He was wild, and I ain't gonna lie. <sighs> yeah, that's what's up, man. I'm finna uh, battle rap trap. Hey, where you at? Nigga, I wish you would. Yeah, yeah. You too. Oh. You too. Bills. You know I'm going at managers too. You know what? That's what I'm going to do. Entourage managers and bloggers. That's the next. That's the next. So, look, you better tell that nigga I know how to rap for real. Man, man we, listen, we going viral here, man, this me because I'm definitely making me a song. Yeah, I'm going to respond. He, I a swear lot. I'm responding. <laughs> You can wheel here. I'm responding. Ooh. Send beats now. Because if you diss me, it's up. <laughs> yeah, send me beats now. Let me see. I think, I think I'm going to use this beat too, y'all. Before I get out of here, I think I'm going to let y'all hear the beat I'm going to use. I don't know. I think this one I'm going to use. Let me hear the beat go crazy. I'm going to let y'all hear this shit right now. We going old school. Send me that same beat. Fuck out of here. Ooh. This, this what I think I'm going to We going old y'all. school. Send me that same beat, <laughs> Quest. You feel me, Quest? <laughs> Hey, that's what I think I'm gonna use. Who shit that? Y'all get on hey. my nerves sometimes, bro. What's the beat? Here it comes. Hold on, here it comes. Hold on. Listen, right here. It's perfect for y'all, right here, bro. Yeah. I know you ain't talking about me, Cole. Get on my nigga, you love my <laughs> <laughs> nah, don't <laughs> stop. Leave me <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Polo, call nah, home. Send me that takeover. 
Oh, yeah. Fuck it. You got to get back. <laughs> Send me that takeover, G. Fuck it, man. It proved you lost already. Right, I'm a, listen, Send me that takeover, Boomer. I'm gonna Fuck brainstorm, it. I'm going to brainstorm some of these tracks and see what's the best one for y'all. And I got you. Y'all stay tuned, man. Blog of this coming soon. With big money, the small change. Two words after this. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, ball game. This nigga. All right. Nah, that was fun. Shout out here, man, man. Another dynamic space quest. McCody, the guys here, froze. You know, all the bloggers. Listen, man. I ain't gonna lie, Polo. We been gone. I think we back, G. Yes, we sir. back up, G. Listen, we back up, Capo. All right, all right. Henny, man, get all the spaces, G. We back oh, up. Man, bad, bad money, bad money, man. <laughs> We back up, G. Damn, G. That was hey. Shout out the boss too. The boss, you be hey. The boss. I'm gonna holler at you. Don't worry about that. We keep our business. Our business. We ain't gotta do all that. But listen, at the same time, shout out you for the dope combos, man. The boss be coming with them dope combos. You feel me? Us St. Louisans, they gonna pull up for and all that. Man, y'all gotta. They, they the boss make the, the power ball. moves, G. Niggas gotta stop playing with the boss. G. <laughs> Black companies, you know, you know, Cola, you know, you always home, man. You always home for the yeah, ball. Yeah, man. Self validated, man. We self validated ourselves in this shit. They don't like that the most. Nah, Hitman drop Hitman really drop a blog of this. I'm a spawner to that. I ain't gonna lie to you. He getting cooked. Yeah, I'm going to get my honey K. I ain't gonna lie to you. He getting cooked, yes, sir. I'm cooking him. I'm going to get my honey K. He getting <laughs> Miss this? What's that nigga sir say? Miss this shitting me? Who's shit, on that me. card? <laughs> that's what now nah, that's what hitman said. Who's on that card? Yo, sir. <laughs> Miss this? No. I really rap though. That's what niggas really don't know. Like the boss. I really get active with this shit. I just don't bring that here because I ain't clout chasing. But I really get active. Nigga don't want to play that verse reverse beat on a beat with me. And I ain't even heated up. I ain't rapped in a while. I be coming off the elbow rusty. I pull my stone cold knee braces out and just get active. Don't let me get in my pocket with a little EP or something. Nah, the stone, the stone cold the knee braces. The stone cold knee braces. <laughs> <Yeah. got> <laughs> stone cold yeah, knee braces ought to get active on one of these niggas. Oh, God. I'm a different blogger. These niggas, me and Battle Rap Traps, you know, niggas like that. Polo, niggas don't know. Polo got so, like, we different niggas, bro. We didn't really been in that booth. Niggas got mixtapes for real. These niggas just be talking about rap. And some of them significant. But they ain't did this shit, G. Uh. You feel me? One take shawties and all that. After learning how to punch in and all that, then you become one take shawty. You need all that punch in. One take me, she. I know this shit already. I came to the booth with this shit rehearsed in my mind. I done went over it and filled in and scratched out and did so much. I done wrapped it so much at the crib. By the time I got to the studio, four, five songs in my mind. I don't even need the paper no more. Because I done just wrapped it all day. You know, when you get in that rapper bag, you ain't listening to nobody else. You don't care about nobody else. You ain't even thinking about no other music. You just playing your shit. That's the greatest part of music because you can really create from that standpoint. When you really in a bag of listening to other niggas, it's hard to, for me, it's hard to create because you don't want to say nothing nigga said. You don't want to make it seem like you stole nothing because that authenticity of it is just different. Hey, Carl, what you got rid oh, of? Oh, they ain't know I tapped into that pocket. Oh, huh? You got rid of the album. Shit. What albums? The, uh, the review on the albums and shit. No, nah, I ain't stopped doing the reviews. These niggas just slowed up, bro. Like, I, bro, I want to do a battle rap music concert. I've been saying this shit. Niggas want to do three-day battle events like they just not tired. Like, folks, why you going to have a battle Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, folks, when you can use one of them days as a real artist day? Because y'all all are artists. It makes no sense. If everybody comes to the event and eight battle rappers uh, battling, the eight I know not battling, I'm going to just do a, a, a hosting or a meet and greet, open mic or whatever, or a little concert. Why not? It's going to sell the same tickets. Niggas are already in town. They are already doing they want to. I've been saying this shit. G, but DNJ Black started playing a couple of songs on the stream, and y'all act like he started this shit. But y'all know who been doing the top tens. Y'all know who got the battle rap music for 2001 all the way up to 2024. Y'all know what the encyclopedia of battle rap music is. That's me. <laughs> but y'all want to play these games and not get this artist money, bro. We can really throw a battle rap concert every weekend of an event, but these niggas get battle rapped out. Every league got to have a, a battle rap day. Like, bro, no. I like when uh, OSB of them that time they had twerking them perform and all that, and he did his musu and all that, and that, that shit was fire. It won. It was a day before or something. They just was doing. They won too. They called him up. He did rider. 
I like when Rod and even though Remy, if she would have did it one day and one day, I like when Rod and Luke Castro went up there and went crazy with that zoo when they had Connie Diamonds and all of up there. That was fire. But look at that opportunity too that opened up for Connie Diamonds with her and Remy with the feature. So networking and networking. You see what I'm saying? They got a banger now. You feel me? She about to go on tour. So, you know, Connie Diamonds finna be able to come out and do that song with her. Shit works. You never know. Fat Joe them all be in the building. Y'all niggas better start taking advantage of these opportunities through this concert. Stop playing. T-Top used to have music at his, at, 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 at the uh, battle events. I ain't seen the nigga with a CD. Now I just see it with a pound of weed. Shit crazy. Now that new T-Top go crazy, though. I ain't gonna lie. Go fuck with T-Top. T-Top going crazy, though. Now I can't say T-Top. T-Top last two shits went crazy. Yo, but keep it a buck. T-Top going crazy. Nah, T-Top been doing mm-hmm. good on the music. So I put the uh, I put the link to the beggar site in the uh, Jumbotron, just in case anybody in here, listeners, whoever don't got it, get it downloaded before next week, man, if y'all want to play some bets. Oh, but remember, okay. it's the voting poll. Oh, that was, yeah, that was Henny Man. Okay, shout out Henny Man. That was Henny Man League. When y'all were twerk performing at Martinis, y'all recording and all that. That was fire, Henny. We got to bring that back, G. We need an all-artist day. We got too many fire niggas. I love to see Chess actually perform some of that dope-ass music he got, bro. Like, that nigga, yeah, that got nigga got some heat, heat bro. Ass. Av. It's a lot of niggas. Dre Dennis. Yep. Shit. The Ride Bill Ride Collector. Castle. We can go on and on. Uh-huh. We can go to the side. Passwords. Ill Mac. Uh, fucking uh, Eddie I. Like, bro, some niggas make some that dope nigga fucking music in there. Paz got some shit. Eddie I got some shit, too, though. Geechee. You got a lot of niggas. You got a lot of niggas. My nigga Merlo dropping shit. He like, bro, we all, listen, it's music around here, bro. We just got to, it got to be a day where a nigga actually don't over battle rap it. No, stop doing these three-day battle rap events. It's a league. One of these leagues should throw, hey, bro, niggas, n- niggas should be trying to overcharge you. You know, they going to already be in the city. You want to do something towards the music shit. Hey, bro, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use my event and my net brand name to throw the concert, bro. OSBL presents concert series, battle rap edition. Shit, you got Lou Ryder, Twerk All them, right? Ace I mean, Ace make dope music. You got folk premier niggas that make dope music right in your thing. Fuck them. Uh, uh, man, this is the first concert we can finna do live on the YouTube. Pack the motherfucking building. People will fly out for that because Twerk make good music. Ace make good music. Lou Catalog Crazy. Yeah, Ryder make dope music. Henny Man also make dope music. They got five niggas you can go see just on some fucking pull up music. Y'all in New York. Capo make music. You got Arsenal come in and out of there. Arsenal make dope at Arsenal. Another nigga make dope music. We can't leave that nigga art. Shotgun Shug. You, these all, if you want to do a Jersey circuit. All them niggas make fire music, bro. What's a five or an eight to ten minute set just getting your shit off? And we know we don't want to see you hopping around. We want to see you do like when Surf was sitting down in the chair letting this shit rock. Like when Arsenal did it. Like do some do some uh unplug type shit. Chef Trez. Like, bro, we got too many fire niggas that's not really displaying that other side, bro. Oh God. Trez got some heat. Trez got heat, fool. Trey has got some heat, fool. Yeah, that battle rap this one. Verb. Verb, another nigga cold on that music shit. Boy, cold, bro. Talk that shit. That music, that boy get real active. I don't love you like I used to. That nigga be talking. That nigga got the hook to that bitch, too. You know, like, I know them songs, G. I ain't gonna front on no nigga music that's fire. If you if you fire, even niggas like my boy Stu, uh, uh, Stewie Newton. Stewie make fire music, bro. No bullshit. Niggas ain't even think I knew that. Stewie makes fire music. I listen to them all, bro. It ain't a nigga I ain't listen that, that got music. I ain't, even the Dirtbag Dance, Rome. These niggas got music, bro. I couldn't believe it either, dog. I understand. I know a lot of y'all like, damn, really? Yeah, I didn't either. I didn't, hey, I didn't believe it either. I mean, me and Polo did. I mean, these ain't no shots. I did see... uh. Me and Polo did used to do a thing with the battle rap music shit called Verse Verse for Verse. It's on the YouTube back in the day. I see my boy Bad and they picked it up on the uh thing, but they doing it with the music. That's fire. We also used to do the motherfucking, you know, go back to the history, top 10 battle rap videos when niggas, but I, I wasn't I wasn't as hot as I was now as, as then. So niggas really was overlooking it. I'm going to keep it 100, boom. Nigga, you know how I, I was like a new blogger, so I was in that new battle rapper. You know, when you're doing some fire, but they really not paying attention, even though it's fire, but who are you? So that's 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 the stage I was in. But I think right now, if I did one of them bitches, it'd go viral. 
I ain't gonna lie. I was doing top 10 diss songs, top 10, all that shit, bro. Let's get back to that music. But for some reason, somehow, listen, I'm with y'all. I've been here. Verb is so-and-so, I guess, lighting up kills. But at the same time, with that being said, make sure y'all tune into that OSBL versus Gates of the Guard. I'm finna go over that because I gotta listen. I'm gonna see what's going on because Ace, OSBL, and Gates, they was acting a fool on that promo. Now, this is what I was telling my boy Frank. It's timing. Now, I stay timing and heat this bitch up because I seen Dre Dennis talking about the got bowling numbers. I seen Ace I mean talking about, nigga, you ain't never paid my whole fee. Your ass cheap and y'all ain't really got it like that. Y'all a platform, we a league, we do different shit. So listen, I'm, I'm all y'all. Go see what my boy Verb on.